<laughs> Alright, hello everybody, welcome to Twilight 2000 Alpha. Uh, I just want to stress that this is the Alpha, these are not the final rules. They came out last week, we're taking it for a test drive by playing through the included scenario, The Prison. Uh, tonight I have these lovely players joining me as we make our way through. Uh, on top of warning you that this is Alpha rules and not the final rules, uh, I'm also going to warn you that we'll probably make mistakes uh, so be prepared we've all been reading the rules for the last three or four days trying to get them down but with any new game mistakes are bound to happen so we are going to try and help each other out and call them out as we see them so to start off we're going to do a little round table we'll have everybody introduce their characters there's um a whole bunch of information at the top of their character sheet such as nationality the branch of the military they're in their rank their moral code their buddy within the squad their big dream, and how they met the group. So we're going to start with Lieutenant Finley Slater. Uh, sweet. All right. Uh, Lieutenant Finley Slater, or LT, he is American. He is from the military. Um, his military rank is obviously lieutenant. His moral code is others rely on you to survive, and it's your job to keep them alive. His buddy is Viper. And his big dream uh, essentially is that he understands in war that we're all kind of chess pieces and pawns and that it's just our job to try and slowly get us to the you know winning point and so he knows that sacrifices must be made even though he tries his best to keep all of his uh, unit alive nice and he is an officer as his uh how class did you, how'd you meet the group or did they meet you because you're the officer i think he met the group probably he would go with uh tonka trunk I think him and would know each other, but a lot of the locals, I think, is what we've probably recruited. Who's Tonka Trunk? Uh, Jeff. Jeff. Yeah. Marcus Thompson. Thompson. <laughs> <laughs> so we probably, I think, we probably recruited a lot of locals because maybe our previous unit got right. hit pretty hard, and so we're trying to get some local militia and people to try and help us with our next oh. missions that we've gotten. He's he's in, he's un he's invincible like a Tonka truck, and he hits hard like a truck. So, sure. You got your nickname? We're gonna see. No, All he's right. rusty like a Tonka truck. <laughs> oh, <laughs> left in the sandbox to rot. All right, start All right. the kill count right now. Here we go. <laughs> what if what if there was no combat at all in this, Jeff? I wouldn't be here next Tuesday. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Yes, you would. <laughs> all right. Next up, we have Stanley Pickles Majuski. Right. So, yeah, so Pickles, uh, he's Polish. Uh, he is a specialist and sort of the local uh, local Polish militia, whatever whatever's going on on the ground. Uh, he uh, so like his specific class, he's a, he's a mechanic, but his like his focus is on guns and gun repair and gun development. So like I have a specialty that's that's gunsmithing. Uh, so the moral code that he lives by is that there's uh, there's nothing that can't be repaired. Um, some of that's just like he can repair, you know, like equipment and things, but maybe there's something bigger than that. Uh, his buddy is the other, uh, is the other local, uh, is it Ken? Is it Melisna? How do you pronounce your name? Melisna. Uh, we, I don't know, I think we're both power squatters at, at like the same gym or something, whatever that was. Uh, yeah, we're but, burly boys. Yeah. yeah, we're burly boys, and uh, yeah. And the uh, biggest dream is, or the big dream is that our unit will always have the biggest gun. So kind of just obsessed with getting bigger guns and giving them to the rest of the squad. Uh, and I think like, I just put in terms of how I got with the group that the groups, you know, someone, somebody from the group just grabbed me when things were going pear shaped because they just figured they needed a mechanic at some point and a mechanic needs somebody to shoot the guns. And so everything just kind of worked out that way. Uh, but yeah, that's that's pickles. Sintrox in the chat said that uh, the great, the grand, grand, grandson of Stanley Majewski died a horrible death in their game group <laughs> Rocks four hours ago. They get yes. the reference. Yes, my <laughs> my, uh, my Majewski died a heroic death. Uh, <laughs> he did. He actually was he pretty fulfilled heroic. his uh, his destiny. Watched the planet explode below me. It's Too great. bad you're not a drummer. Because <laughs> in any uh, Metalocalypse fans, you can be pickles the drummer. Oh wow! Yeah, that's a, I was like, "What?" Because <laughs> I was thinking it's a, it's a juice key, and I was like, "What?" The pickles. I forgot all about that. Pickles. pickles. That's right. All right, Oak. Tell us about Robert Jennings. 
Uh, Robert Jennings is his uh, given American name. He is a CIA spook. He goes by Viper as his call sign. But at the moment, only uh, Jeff's character knows me as uh, Viper. Everybody else knows me as Casper Brzezinski. I'm a Polish national, apparently. Uh, the way I got in with the group was uh, I got messed up in an alley trying to... Uh, get a mark for uh, our sniper and they left me for dead since Jeff knew about it uh, or his character the group come and rescued me but he's the only one that knows I'm a, a double agent yes double agent CIA oh, my, uh, my big dream is to find the secret of operation reset all right Malizna what how do you say your name Malizna <laughs> Malizna Malizna <laughs> Melisna. That's me. Can you tell I us about am... Melisna, please? <laughs> yeah. I am Ken. I'm playing Melisna. His real name is Miroslav Razniak. I am also a local uh, Polish man. Um, my big dream is to get revenge against those in power. I don't have a military, uh, obviously, uh, rank. I'm a civilian that was sort of caught up in the war, and I met the group because they saved me and with nothing left uh, I joined them to get revenge on those in power <laughs> yes and last but not least Tonka truck Sergeant uh, Marcus Thompson <laughs> hey, yeah Jeff you don't uh, get a pick you don't get to pick your nicknames they get no, picked well, there you too go. Late. <laughs> so uh yeah Staff Sergeant uh, Marcus Thompson of US Army uh, sniper and uh let's see his uh moral code is uh fear will only kill you his uh big dream is uh to top the confirmed kill record from the last world war he's a uh, pretty serious uh not messing around type guy uh his buddy is viper and they probably were sent over here to train some of the local militia get with them to just to further fight the cause on kind of a uh, not some in your face type with locals and whatnot. So, gotcha. Got it. Gotcha. Cool. So we are gonna we're gonna prepare to dive into Twilight 2000 uh, again. People who are just joining us, these are the alpha rules. So things will change between what you see on here tonight and when the finished game comes out in approximately spring. Is what we were told this morning. All right, so your mission, your mission tonight. Let me get your briefing here. So, do, do, do. there is intel about a, a, a rumored prison uh, that is under protection by Polish soldiers. It is said to be run by a man of God by the, who goes by Rasputin. And word is they have been able to cultivate the land to grow wheat and potatoes. So many potatoes, in fact, they're producing va vast amounts of alcohol, which could be turned into or used as fuel. It is your job to locate and confirm the existence of this prison turned monastery. Uh, find out what's going on. See if you can acquire these goods for the you or you're all NATO, right? For NATO purposes. And you want to keep these nice. out of the hands of the Russians. And it has been rumored that the Russians have been snooping around that area as well. And that their intelligence has picked up information regarding this place. And this is too valuable of a resource to allow to fall into Russian hands or Marauder hands. Because Marauders are the other threat here in the uh, the Polish war zone. That's like, lo like local Marauder? Yeah, they're known as the Shepherd's Flock. And they're just like a gang that kind of roam the uh the war zone for their own loot and plunder the so Russians you're gonna the potatoes for vodka you're supposed to uh, your mission is to locate the prison <laughs> gain entry find out exactly what is going on there and ensure that it does not fall into russian hands got it makes sense all right, all right. um but robert jennings you get a separate additional order on top of that you are told it is believed that there may be intel related to operation reset in the prison's files or databases 
These rooms are true. It's imperative that you locate it and return it to your superiors. And it's in the prison? In the prison, possibly in the files or databases of the... Uh, it's a former prison, so going through their files, you may find this information. They have electricity? Like generators and stuff? Yeah, or do they... You'll find out when you get there. Okay. That intel is not known. Uh, so okay. for Operation Reset, I'll give everybody just kind of, if you didn't read in the book and for the people at home what that is. So Operation Reset, here's the write-up from the book. It is a massive long-term undertaking initiated by remains of the leadership of the U.S. and its NATO allies to restore the world to some semblance of civilization. The operation includes the acquisition of key information, geography, and technology, and the military offensive was one part of this larger objective. Some intel about this plan has leaked to rivals and even enemies, triggering a secret war between the four intelligence agencies of the CIA, the DIA, the KGB, and the GRU. So when you play Twilight 2000, the whole the whole goal, the overarching goal of this game is to get more information and get to the bottom of Pro Operation Reset and kind of uncover what's really going on. That's our big overarching like meta plot. Meta plot. If we were going to be playing an ongoing campaign, that's like what you're you're striving towards is to uncover and get these details about Operation Reset and also ensure that it does not fall into enemy hands. Cool. All right. Cool. Cool. What, and we're not uh, holding. We're not holding this this objective. We're just gaining information and then leaving. Get in there. Prison. Find out what's going Prison. on and acquire it if possible and we don't have to we don't have to hold it you don't have to hold it okay now you say that we have to find it but you have general map. coordinates okay. um of where it is okay. so i've got okay. it marked okay. on the map for you guys we right. got general coordinates we're going to travel okay. there it's going to take a couple days travel okay. to get um to our location cool all right any questions before we get in here and start bumbling around uh, the Polish, so. uh, is this like a militia group? Are these Polish, like, because I know there's splinter groups in the, the war. Yeah, so there's Polish soldiers, and then there's the marauders, and that's the shepherd's flock. Okay, so these Polish soldiers aren't the guys that broke off into their own thing, like their, their, uh, their own splinter government, right? Correct. Okay, so they're it's... friendly to NATO. <laughs> yes. Not and it's that... also believed that the prison is under the protection of Polish soldiers. Okay. So like, would it be because I because because Zmajewski's from you know he he's actually military, mm -hmm. so it's like local local army. So it would be the same branch that he was in, or are we talking? Quite possibly, yeah, yeah, okay. like just general army. Yeah, you, these are my friends. We'll be fine. It'll be great. <laughs> nice. Super yes, easy. you did the first accent, which means I'm also <laughs> doing the accent. I am, I am big pharma. I am big pharma. <laughs> <laughs> give me a lot of that. Group of big pharma. <laughs> I am. I am oh, big. Geez. Everyone's just big pharma. Everybody oh. big pharma. <laughs> All right. So if you head oh, over I mean. to the travel map, you will see your little Humvee. Even though you guys, so you guys decided to take horses. We yeah! had two options. We rolled twice, or I rolled twice on the table, and they got either horses as their option of uh, getting around, or an APC. And horses were the obvious <laughs> answer. We're so smart. <laughs> They're stealthy. They're stealthy, yeah. and they can get around difficult terrain way easier than yeah. a than a vehicle. And you can you look eat at, them when times are hard. Them, yeah. you, when you look yeah. at the rules hey. for traveling, like the 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 terrain you go over actually affects how far you can go as well. So if you're driving a vehicle, you can actually get stuck and waylaid and things like that. Horses, yeah, it's not really an issue. Smajuski's so still kind of like worked on them a bit and like put like cool mufflers and crap on them just because. <laughs> That's what a mechanic's supposed to do. It's like when you're a kid and you put like a, an empty Slurpee cup in your spokes. To make Is that what you did in like Canada? Playing cards. Yeah, it don't you? Like that. No, we put $100 cards. bills. <laughs> $100 bills. Oh. It's like a million Canada bucks. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right. Let's get this started. So yeah. we are going to do marching on the map. So everybody gets to select a roll when we go into this into the marching phase so someone typically keeps watch so you're scouting you're looking for any sort of enemies or encounters that may pop up or any signs of danger that uh will be along the way i don't know who's good at that keep watch is that's a survival 
Um, that's a recon. Or is that recon? Yeah. I got a I got a, a B intelligence and a C recon. I'm A intelligence and C recon. Oh, uh, there you go. B intelligence, B recon. Oh. I'm not. Uh, what are you two? Yeah. A couple options. <laughs> <laughs> that's good. Uh, you can I'm do used it. to being a forward scout. So. Yeah, you go ahead and do it then. If someone wants to, there's also um, you can scrounge while you're going, and you can look yeah, you scrap can, like, along the way, which is also forage recon. hunt. Yeah, yeah. is that forage recon hunt. or is that is it tech for scrounge? Scrounging is recon also. Is it okay? I made a cheat sheet with that on there too, because okay. right? I was like, I knew this I'll was going to come up. Um, I feel like so that's something I would probably do. Yeah, top right hand corner, that second cheat sheet I made. Okay. Everything else is survival, though. Those two are recon, and everything else falls under survival. Wow, I suck at all of this. I'm guessing good for morale. <laughs> well, that's what you get for being the face. You just, yeah, you yeah, save that, yeah. save that pretty face for the important uh, times. Look pretty. I think what I do have you mean one by that. So <laughs> for the important times, the night times. <laughs> the one is needed. Looks like it. It's real cold out here. Yeah, yeah. On some ambient sounds. That's why Jeff shaved. <laughs> <laughs> I, I like to be the one. I'm the one man out, and I like that. You guys can adjust the sound if it's too loud on your on your foundries. Oh yeah, I hear it now. It should just be okay. like birds crying yeah. and yeah. wind, and it's just ambient noise as you're traveling through the war zone. Very peaceful, relaxing post-apocalyptic. So, it's great. <laughs> There's not death lurking around the corner. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, exactly. You don't know what's around the corner. So uh, who, who wants who wants to keep watch as we as we make our first steps towards our M mission? Melisna Melisna will keep watch because we still have people to. Uh, oh no, wait, keeping watch is the one that goes forward. He's our point guy. Yeah, it's, you're the scout. So never mind. That's so that's, that's Viper. Uh, that's me. Yeah, Viper. Viper. It's Viper. I just think about okay. that car from the '90s, Viper, the show, the Dodge Viper. So yeah. go ahead. Why don't you go ahead and make me the, your um, lead the way or keep watch roll? Sorry, it's lead the way in other games. Get confused yeah. with my um Okay, so it's uh, should just one be a recon. skill and one from the stat, correct? Yep. Yeah. Okay. yeah. And it's it's day and... so the 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 it's broken a day, evening, morning, day, evening, night. It is morning, so you've got clear sunshine, it's it's just basic terrain, there's not gonna be any negatives, so yeah, your okay. base die plus your your uh, skill. Do they need to be yeah, rolled separately some... or do, together? I think you can do them together and then if you click the number that comes up, it'll break it out. Like if you click it in the chat there, you got a fifty. Yeah. Woo! Right. Oh, I can't see what those are. Oh, you can hover over them. A seven and an eight. So all you need for success is a six. Yep. So you succeed. Successes. So nothing is gonna get it. Nothing is gonna get the jump on you guys, as you're making your way through. As you're riding nice. your horses through the forests of Poland, uh, trying to avoid any uh, imperial entanglements. So you're riding. You got wolves. You're. Oh yeah. yeah there's there's them wolves. <laughs> <laughs> so you're riding along oak and in front of you you see uh, a burnt out derelict bus sitting in like the woods it's not even on the road it's in the woods in a clearing now you okay, see I'll, it before uh... if there is anybody there you see it before they see you sort of thing You've got the jump on this. Okay, yeah. I'm going to make sure I'm in the bushes. I'll pull out my binoculars and uh, see if I can see any people or anything. Sure, you got binocs. Does that uh, give you a bonus to a recon roll? Does it give you a, like a gear die when you roll that? or? Uh, that I'm not positive on. Uh -huh. Gear. That's all weapons. I'm close to so the gear in the book. While he's looking up, just so we all know, uh, when you march and you can march at the same, everyone can march at the same time that uh, someone else keeps watch. Yes. So you can go up at the same time. That's the only one that it's um, all together. Gotcha. I'm not seeing it in here. Uh, just yeah. Scrant, uh, just going through it, and we don't need it to hold us up. So just go ahead and make plus me plus two, Matt. Plus two, plus, plus two. Yeah. Make me a recon roll at plus two. So upgrade your. Your dice. So two steps. Two steps, yeah. So d twenties. No, so if it no, goes it above a d twelve, then it's a d twelve, oh. and you get an additional d six on top of it if it goes up and above. 
a d12. Yeah, because uh, I'm already at 10, so that put me okay. at 12, and then another step, so it's a 12. 12 and a d6. Okay. So, nice. D6. What do we got? A three and a six. Six is success. It's all you need. Yeah, so you're scanning the area, and you're not seeing any signs of life. There's just a derelict bus. It looks like the ground is singed uh, around it. There was a fire here recently. There's still remnants of a fire uh, a little bit in the bus itself. But whoever started this or did this uh, appears to be long gone. Okay, I'll cautiously sneak down there, watch for any kind of booby traps or anything. Yeah. See if there's any gear or anything useful. Sure. Yeah, there's actually quite a bit of scrap uh, around the area. You can uh, you can go ahead and start scrounging. Well, so well, it look like it would, enough that it would be like it'd be better for the group to go through this. Yeah, guys or... can all go through it. I'm gonna hop over back to the others though and see exactly what they want to be doing right now. Yeah, I'll be heading back if there. It looks like there's a lot of stuff to go through. That way, it, it's faster for multiple people to search. Do well, well. Wait. Do we need to, you know, scrounge for scrap right now? Ammo. It's a sure. random table, so you I never mean, know what you're going to end up with. Sure, and it would be stupid yep. not to, not to, you know. Pickles said he clean, wanted to do you know, it. Clean the bones. It you it is the wasteland, so you kind of pick up and use whatever you get, and that's also m like money. Like you use whatever mm -hmm. you find as money to barter as well. Yeah. It's also, yeah. we're not gonna repairing things. Like if you're if certain things break down, you need right. parts to be able to repair weapons. Them, so, yeah. And we're gonna keep you know couple horses on this side couple horses on that side we're not tying them all to the same tree sure if you guys want to do your scrounge rolls here in this in this zone that um oak has uncovered it'll be a plus two to your scrounge roll okay because there's just kind of like a cache of things and that's here. a recon now is that for everybody yeah or we do it as everybody wants roll. to do a scrounge you can scrounge here as well oak on top of your last one so it's a recon roll if you're scrounging okay. and if you don't have two. anything in it it's just a it's your just your basic. It's just your ability. Okay. Intelligence. And that's a plus two. So yep. it's a D twelve for me. This is at a plus two also. Or you, know, plus this two. you know what this reminds me of? Is have you guys ever played games like Escape from Tarkov or any of those like yep. those like hyper realistic like uh um like military based games? This is what this reminds me of. Like the amount of crunch that it has. <laughs> Alright. I got a seven and a one. I did not pass. And you always modify your skill first, right? That's what it is. It's always skills. Yeah. Uh, I got two successes. Um I just have one. That's a great question, Ken. Uh I believe so. I yeah. believe I believe it's true. I just was asking. Alright. So Robert Jennings. Go ahead and roll me a D100, please, and I'll tell you what you find. D100. As you're poking around this old derelict burnt-out bus. 62. You find... Uh, roll me another D6, please. You find six adult DVDs. Someone's stash <laughs> in the back of this bus. This will go well with his pretty face. <laughs> pretty whoa, nice. whoa, whoa. <laughs> you find six adult film DVDs. Well, I found this some entertainment, but I uh, don't think we have anything to play them on. Yeah. Um, <laughs> well, love uh, DVDs. Smile and chunk them over uh, <laughs> Tonka, go ahead and roll me a D100, please. All right. <laughs> right in the middle. See if you get something better than porno. You What's found... better than porno? <laughs> you found... You found uh, it's a blessing you're... for us right now. You uh, found game. some powdered baby formula. What? And what that actually can be used as is D6 field rations. You can actually consume oh. this. It's food. It's nourishment. Oh, nice. So that you actually found six. something useful. Even this baby formula, everything out here in the war zone has a, a use or purpose. Uh, except well, for maybe D6. those DVDs. Can I roll ahead D6 right now? Yeah, please. 
plus it's five soldiers and a baby. There That's we go. That's actually the campaign we're doing. Six rations. <laughs> yes. Uh, I'll oh, hand you... out hand out a ration to everyone and. Oh, you guys get some in infant formula. Hell yeah! We each get like one of those little scoops full. There you yeah, go. exactly. Yeah, okay. protein powder. Okay. Just scoop it right into Melissa's mouth. He likes it dry. <laughs> <laughs> uh, and pickles, you get to roll twice. You had right. two successes on there. Let's see, I got a twenty-four and a ninety-six. Nice. 20, twenty-four is a crowbar. Nice. That sounds Sweet. great. Uh, it's either tech plus one when you're doing rough work, which is good for you. Yeah. Or it yeah. can be used as a club. Okay. The old Polish screwdriver. <laughs> <laughs> what was the other one? A 91? Uh, 96. Thanks. 90, oh. hmm. You found a broken wristwatch. 91 was a video game console. Oh, I was like, 91? Oh. Ooh, man, we probably got to put the porno in that. <laughs> on yeah. old PlayStation? <laughs> just kidding. Oh. Yeah, just kidding. It's an N64. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's a cartridge. Oh. Useless. All right, so the other thing you... You got was a broken wristwatch. Yeah, you can use them Might as be. like electronic parts. Yeah, yeah so that's, that's an electr that's all electronic parts. One yeah, is what it it oh, counts okay. as. Okay, so sweet. You got a spare part radio thing. or something. Yeah. I just noticed if you'd roll ninety seven, it's a yellowed copy of Twilight two thousand RPG first edition. That's hilarious. Nice. Oh wow. <laughs> you want to want to sit down play and play in guys? the game? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Sit down in the derelict <laughs> bus and play Twilight two thousand. Hyper 2000. meta. Oh, if I rolled eighty six, I would have got a trombone. <laughs> Oh, look at that. The old oh, rusty trombone. The old <laughs> Polish screwdriver. <laughs> okay, here we go. All right, all right. Move it along. All right, so you guys, you guys, it takes some time in this area. and um... I'm sorry, no love for Melisna? What happened here? Oh, Melisna. Did you get a success? Oh, you rolled privately. I... That's why. I... Oh, oh, I, I, I can't see to. when you roll privately. I, don't, I can't even see it. I just saw question marks. Yeah. We still have chance for Melissa a just, that, Melissa that just sits, Melissa. He just squats. He just squats. <laughs> he just squats. He just squats and hangs out with his, DVD his player. Horse. That's what we're looking for. Portable okay, so how many DVD how many successes player. did you get? Must be on watch. I got one. Okay, roll the D one hundred, please, Melissa. Squats in the back of the bus and finds something. Bus. It's hey, still private. Hey, what are you doing back there? Can you, can you turn your rolls to public? Go right above. Oh, the that's wall. so. Weird. I see it now. I, that's so weird. I was like, I don't know why it's doing that. I got a forty-two. Forty-two. You got gaffer tape. Tech plus one when jury rigging. Very nice. Nice. That's actually pretty good. All right. So you guys spend some time here. You scrounge around. Your horses get a bit of a break. And you find some uh, some materials out here in the war zone. I can't move this. Oh, because I'm a player. It's so confusing when you have the two foundries open when you can move one, oh. one and not on the other. Technically, you move two squares, so you move forward a little bit more. And it is now daytime. Do you want to uh, press on and keep marching towards the prison? Yeah. Yeah. All right. Who is, uh, who's doing the scouting? Is it... Uh, That's me. Yeah, let's keep, Viper, let's again? keep uh, Viper on that. All right, Viper. It's daytime. It's bright. You're going over clear terrain. Go ahead and make me another roll. There's no modifiers whatsoever. Seven, a seven uh, and a four. That's a seven, yeah. So you're riding your horse. You, you're riding up ahead. You're quiet. You're sticking to the tree lines. Nice. And as you ride forward, you come around a bend, and the road is completely cut off. It appears that there's sandbags have been piled up. There's an old pickup truck that's parked uh, in between the sandbags blocking the road. And uh, you clearly make out a group of Polish... Um, marauders that looks like uh, members of the shepherd's flock have uh, put up a roadblock to stop anybody coming through I'll report back to everybody else hey uh, looks like we have uh, some friends up ahead wanting to uh, stop anyone from traveling through what do we know about the shepherd's flock Matt as far as intel goes shepherd's flock they're roles. basically like the thugs they're just kind of like they can be paid off they can be bought off they're just kind of in it for their own fortune so like you could try going and talking to them. they're not, like if this were if Soviets, melissa showed up would... with some porno with some porno tapes possibly <laughs> i don't know uh like if this is if this was the soviets they'd shoot you on sight but the marauders are different they can be spoken to but they are they are known to be prone to to violence um 
So it could go either way. Or you could just shoot them. You could attack them also. They're not the best equipped soldiers. They're kind of like ragtag. They, they carry whatever they've scrounged and found on the battlefields. So it's not always the most reliable equipment. These also aren't typically trained soldiers as well. So we could bushwhack them with an ambush. You could bushwhack them with an ambush. Say we had a really good snake-like sniper. man. Yeah, and a sniper. <laughs> Yes. Well, uh, hand How me many... the uh, binoculars. Let me go look. How many, if we put the horses, you know, and um, how many of them do we see if we just scout, the, scout this Go ahead and make out. me a recon with your binoculars. Can I roll, can I see them with someone's binoculars? Can I, I, can just use my, I can just use my scope, right? Binoculars give you a plus how, two, don't how forget. Close, how close do you guys want to get, though? Um, well, not you... close at all. Just where we are now. I just want to stop for a minute, wait, you know, watch them for five minutes in case, you know, two of them yeah, are I don't over here close, doing this yeah. or, you know, just to, okay. to give a little bit of time to go by I'll to see you, how many there really minus, are. It'll be a minus one tier roll. So they're in the same hex or one away? They are a few hexes away. You... Oh, okay. O Oak came up and saw them well before they saw him by right. passing his roll. So well, he I came just, around the band, he yeah. saw them, and he went back and reported to you guys. So I'm going to say they're probably five, six hexes away. All right. You're hanging back, oh. and you can see them. Specifically, yeah. five or six. six. Well, I mean, I'm looking. I'm looking through my scope, which Hold can on. see twelve. This guy needs so. To the, the yeah, I'm just trying to roll Hold tactician, on. so I just need to spot them. You are um. one, two, three, four, five, six hexes away from the truck and the and the barricade, the sandbag barricade. Two successes. Two successes. Two? No, ten. Ten, ten gets... is the next bump. Yeah. Still, still a nine is a success. He did get two successes. No. Um, so you study the roadblock there for a while, and you see some guys mingling about, and you see like some guys go behind a really thick set of trees and come back, and you get a good bead and a good count on how many men are there total, because uh, they're not all out in the open, and you see. See about a dozen men. Wow. Okay. They they are not heavily armed, from what you see. They're just. It looks like they're using um, AKs that they've picked up here and there on the battlefield. They're not wearing any armor whatsoever. Okay. Yeah, just see. Yeah, it looks like there's twelve of them out there. Uh, All armed. It's. I don't know if we want to. Seems a little dangerous, if you ask me. Here, let me we... borrow your scope. <laughs> Uh, can I roll a tactician? See if I can get more information about what they're trying to do. Sure. Uh, it'll be at a minus one as well. Can I borrow your scope? Give me your rifle. The soldier's not going to hand over. Well, I'm, I'm rolling command. I'm not, I'm not rolling no. recon. So who's, I rolled Melisna, who's Melisna giving... will take off his binoculars and give them. I was going to say, who's giving you a scope? Because there's no way uh, Tonka's going to hand over his no, rifle. No, no. He's not handing his rifle over. <laughs> so you're going to roll command at a minus one? Because it's not a recon roll; it's a tech. Like as long as I can see the enemy, I can roll it. Mm -hmm. okay. um, but the binoculars are going to give you a plus two, so it'll just be at a plus one. Does that make sense? Yes. I hate having to expand this. Well, I got a twelve. A twelve? It's a double That's success. A two. <laughs> yeah, you you see that there's there's twelve men in in total. Um, they are all carrying AKs. It but says you must tell me something useful about their current organization and their objectives. Looks like they're just thugs. They just want to make some money. They're just trying to rip people off. They're, they're looking the for porno this tapes, is, I heard. This is the only yeah. road um, in and out of here. It's surrounded by thick woods and big rocks. Um, you do see, though, that they do have an RPG stashed away that um, oh. Marcus Thompson was not able to see. So you see in the back of the pickup, one of the guys nice. kind of moves a tarp aside, and there is an RPG there with a couple of rockets. I'll, uh, I'll point, try and guide Tonka's sniper rifle. Well, mm -hmm. if you see there, yeah, there's a big box, and I think there's an RPG. You probably missed it, but uh, right about there, if, you know, if we're looking to get in a scruff or something, we could probably, like, shoot it, blow it up, but maybe uh, Melisna might want it. I don't know. What, what are yeah, you? Good are you part of the Canadian military? What is that? He's uh, right on the border of Canada <laughs> and Minnesota. He's like, <laughs> okay, <laughs> right. Maybe you shoot the uh, RPG and blow them all to hell. Yeah, I mean that's cool with me. 
Well, you always try. Or I could try talking to them if you guys want to. I don't know. I might die though, but. Well, what loss. what do we gain talking? We either want their equipment or, or we don't want. Well, any, maybe they right? can tell us uh, where the prison is or something. You know. <laughs> really got it. Perhaps it's uh, best. Perhaps it's best to avoid entirely. I mean, there there are twelve and we are five. Um, I know you're not very intelligent, but uh, twelve is much greater than five. <laughs> In wow. Poland, school is very important. Yes. I was very good at the geometry. Oh, okay. This is getting intense right now. Yeah. Didn't realize we were uh, recruiting mathematicians here. Yeah. Baby Pole, pole could do this map. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm good with we... bypassing. Yeah, You're in bypass combat? Oh, man. Well, we've we'll learned some away. Are you going to? So you want to talk to them? You want to try and talk your way? They, there's no way around them where, the, where they've set up. They've basically. Uh, oh, there's no way around. Them, yeah. So we can either talk or fight. What do you guys want to do? Aren't we on horses? Yeah. Horses can walk around. around but this is a game, Ken. It's this a, is game, a game. Yeah, it's dense, dense forest <laughs> uh, around them. And big Perhaps. rocks. Perhaps we can lure some away first and, you know, ambush them here and then with thin numbers. Yeah, I could walk out with the porno, you know, maybe uh, they're interested. We do like porno. And that is a good idea. Porno is important. <laughs> is and important. we don't, they have no vehicles, no horses or anything like they that. They just have that see. pickup truck that they've parked oh, they have pickup. across okay. the road blocking between the two sandbags. So basically, if people okay. want to pass, they have to get in it, drive it aside and let okay. you, let you gotcha. go past. How right. about uh, maybe you guys like I set mean, up and I'll go like peacefully yeah. with porno and just uh, have my hands up, uh, try and make peace. Make sure I'm... you mention it is barely legal. <laughs> that seems highly inappropriate. I but I guess it's wartime, so whatever so, you need. Yeah. So you're sending the I mean, NATO I'm... soldier up there to talk to him? All right. I'm I'm setting up a position the best that I can back all here. All right. I... <laughs> of course you are. <laughs> I'm assuming you're all getting off your horses, you're tying them up, you're taking your backpacks yeah. off, horses, all that good yeah, stuff. Yeah, I'm assuming they're, like, getting in position. I'm not going to, like, walk until they're, like, ready. Uh, so we're not ambushing. We're sending We're sending uh, our best face man to talk with the, the porno <laughs> as, um, as, yes. as credentials. Is this... Yes. This is the plan. This I hope you, I hope you, I hope you, I hope you fan them out like, like ID cards. <laughs> This yeah, is I've only got you... a pistol for cover. No, you're riding. You're, you're riding your horse up there, right? Oh yeah, are you riding your horse, uh, Finley? Yeah, yeah. Probably yeah, I would probably ride my horse up horse. there. Yeah. Well, you, then you can get the hell out of there when it all the shit hits a fan, which it's going to. Yeah, I'm gonna. I would be like going up like pretty like nonchalant, not very stealthy. So as as you leave or as you're going, Melissa is gonna uh, hand you the one grenade he was given and just just tuck it into your belly and be like, just in case. I have like five more of these. Suicide vest. Okay, hold on. <laughs> do, do we like this plan? <laughs> yeah, I don't care. It's I'll thin. Do it. it is. This is thin. a terrible plan. You're sending the <laughs> commanding <laughs> officer up there alone. <laughs> Who is second in command? The two poles are just shaking their heads and squatting. <laughs> Who is the new captain? <laughs> Why do you guys squat? Stand up while no, we're three talking. Three poles. <laughs> it is good to keep lower body in shape. I guess you must run fast. <laughs> They're like super disproportionate. I mean, I, I don't care what we do, but I, I'd rather either stand back and just start picking them off at this distance or, I don't know, get a certain number up there so that we can fight. I mean, I don't have to be like right in their face to talk to them, you know, like I right. can talk from a distance. And what if they say, sure, yeah, you can go ahead and go through. Well, then all of you guys situation. just hop up and run. <laughs> Quick, the gate's open, go! Yeah. I don't, I'll explain the situation. Yeah. We'll see. I, in military terms, it's always best to throw as much firepower as fast as you can at a target. Ken, it's a game. This isn't the military. <laughs> this is war. I'm not in the military. I'm just saying that's that's the best odds of taking out, you know, right. a very small, low, you know, target. Surprise. You have the RPG. Believe me, I don't want to be the guy that's saying this stuff either. That's not how I play games. <laughs> but. You're saying it's not a good plan. Well, I'm going to take a good old Jesse here and keep going. 
And we, the rest of us, maybe fan out and be sneaky and get closer and keep eye on him while this is happening. Yeah, I'm going to try to be sneaking forward to a good spot where I can get in pistol range. Mm-hmm. Okay, well, wh- how about I do this? How about I move Without you guys? Without How about I move you to a, to a map? Let's do that. We'll move the, uh... What? Combat map for this? What do you mean? I'm shocked. There are no tokens. Oh, can you guys see what's going on? <laughs> no. Uh, we don't have any tokens. With Not you yet. See. Yeah, yeah. I can. So you can see? Yes. Everybody should have tokens with vision, which is the the weird thing. We're facing the wrong way. I know we're all facing the wrong way. I know, I know, I know. Yeah, because we need to get the hell out of dodge. All right, let me um, <laughs> let me work on this. While you guys continue to talk yeah. about your plan. Oh, the plan's uh, set in stone. I mean, there's nothing to talk about. I'm just fanning out the porno, waving my hands, saying hi. We could get kind of close, what's, keep what's... sniper in back, and we all right. stay quiet and sneaky. And if something goes wrong, we get up and shoot. This is a good idea. That yeah, that that's that's good. Evan, do you see and our goals the. I don't see anything now. The goals the RPG and some of the weapons. Is that what we're? Yeah, they probably. Have I mean, beyond weapons. getting and through. and to bring freedom to these savages. There you go. <laughs> I mean, there I can see. Nobody good is called Marauder, so. Right. It's in the name. Oh, here's a setup. Uh, pickles. Where are you, Jeff? You should be able to see now. Yep, I'm good. Yeah. So who can't see? Me. <laughs> I see the typing, but I don't see like. Oh, you're the you're maps. labeled a soldier too, because I didn't have your name. I'm just gonna put Finn. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You see the typing. That's right. Character permissions. I'm gonna make you. I'm gonna make everyone an owner of yours, so I can see on the okay. overlay what's going on. Okay, cool. Because people on the stream okay. can see my overlay. All right. Uh, can you see now? Yes. Yeah. I just don't. I don't have your token out there, Finn. Do I? Boop. Put you right there. Vision. Boom. I can't move my guy though. One moment. You will. Finn. Everyone. Okay, you should be able to now. You're Soldier 2. I don't know why. Soldier 2. It's not. Okay. It's an alpha, folks. Oh, there we go. Okay. All right, there we go. It's an alpha. There we go. We got got to figure it out. We got to figure it out. So there's a map. We got Finn approaching this roadblock. Let me switch it over on the overlay so people can see what we are looking at so we've got a roadblock here we've got finn uh going up the road towards these uh these marauders everyone else you can go ahead and pick your spots go pick your hexes where you want to be you have the jump on these guys so matt is any is any is anywhere here elevated compared to anywhere else the rocks would be elevated yeah can Mm. can i be on that side of the road or no yep okay you can delete this one because i would like to be right there the other token of me Sure. Within the rocks for cover, but it still being able to see. Yeah, the, I want to uh, come around like truck. over here. I guess probably more like that. No, I'm going watch Matt, for some that. reason, Finn and right. I are connected. You're going to have to make some rolls if you want to go all the way up there, Viper. Click to stay back in the that. road where you guys are at now, you can fan out in that area, but if you want to start moving up and encroach on them, you're going to have to start making some. Click on something else, Ken. Yeah, yeah I click will, your. You might click something else that and then outside. click your guy. Like you know, Got it, thank you. this way, around the edge of the trees and stuff. But yeah, what role do you need? I am going to need recon. Recon for sneak thank sneak, you. and it will be at a. Mm, what do you... so explain to me when, how, where you're doing it. I'm going to go like by Jeff. I'm going to follow the tree line around real cautiously. Nice. I'm not like going straight through the trees. I'm going around as far as outside as I can. Maybe even by those other rocks. He's he's creeping up the back back side of the rocks. He's down here. Oh. That's where he wants to go. Oh, he okay. wants to get right up in their business. Um, it's gonna be It'd at be a nice minus. to be able to see you. It's going to be at a minus two. If you want to get up there. Do you want hey, so? But you've also got Finn marching up at the same time. 
right. I mean, I can wait a little bit if they if they told me they were trying to, you know, right. can, go all can the way Marcus, around. Can Marcus oh, see Sabbath. Viper? Can Marcus can see I... Viper? Where where the hell is Marcus? Um, He's Jeff H. Up Jeff on the, H. On the, I yeah, the yeah, I tried to, but I can't. Can you see Viper? Uh, no. When you click in your token, can you see him? Because no. I've got the the rocks and all that marked out. So if you can't see him around those rocks, then you can't see him. He's behind yeah, the rocks. Okay. I can see right. him. You got to get on the other side. Yeah. Okay. So where everybody's strategically getting. Uh, so even using all those up. trees, it's that big a minus. Yeah. Yeah. Holy shit! It drops it down to a six. Yeah, well, it would actually. Well, you're rolling both stats. Remember, it's not just one dice, unless you don't yeah, have a skill. Yeah, but two d sixes because both of them are. B I've got two d tens, so that drops it down to. A no, it's ten. minus two in both in one. Um, of like, one die. So it goes d eight. Yeah. You only do your skill. You only do your skill. You're right. Okay, so a d six and a d ten. Yeah, there you go. Right. Got a six. Got a there six. Go. I was hoping we we're gonna see our first push, but no. All right, you sneak your way up there and you uh, cut between the the tree lines and the rocks and all that, and you uh, you make your way up to the edge of the rocks. Where are you exactly? I gotta go my GM map. That's where you are. Okay. Yeah, I can see you. Cool. You're down there, and everybody else, you're hanging back. And if you found a position, does anybody want to go up on the rocks to get a better elevated vantage point? If I can see, if I can see the the those guys i'm good where i'm at okay all right Finn, all right. are you just yeah. gonna ride forward on your horse yeah i'll uh ride forward um nonchalant and i will like fan the porno like it's like a you know poker hand <laughs> like a you know like i'm holding cards in my hand and i'm just kind of waving with the other hand you know the good old border canadian you know i was right there on the border friendly guy what? Like hey there guys like a, uh, like a koi uh, geisha Oh, you know, <laughs> yeah, that's what I was thinking, like a fan, right? <laughs> hey, Asian. guys, uh, you guys a little bored? Uh, I got some videos. You're interested? You see, Just like, right speaking around... Speaking English? Yeah. I don't know Polish. <laughs> <laughs> All right around the, uh, the barrier in the trucks, uh, you see five of these marauders raise their AKs and point them at you, and they start screaming at you in Polish. And I just... They sound the, very agitated. I point at the video, like at the porn. You understand this, right? The, I mean, we both get it. The one closest to the truck is like holding up his hand. He's like, stop, stop, stop. Is the only thing you can understand him saying. I'm not moving forward. Like if he. You're just standing there, there holding the. <laughs> well, I'm on the horse. Yeah, I'm just like kind of trotting in circles, like like throw like you know showing it to them, seeing if they're interested. Yeah, nobody there seems to, uh, to understand. Yeah, what, what time of day is it? Just for it is day. So like this okay. morning, day, evening, night. It is day. Got it. Um, does the guy leader guy? Does he look like aggressive when he says stop, or he just doesn't? Yeah, want they to move all closer? look very aggressive. Now, looking through any insignia, or or we're just seeing the guy talking as the leader. Now I'm just looking through my scopes. I don't hear I don't hear anything. You don't know but... he's the leader, but he's the one definitely taking point and talking and yelling at uh, Finn. Okay, so nothing special about him. He's just No, no, he okay. doesn't have like a rank on him or anything. Okay. Like, said, like these guys are all um cuz I'm I'm looking for anything that looks like a bunch rank. Of, of grunts and thugs that have kind of banded together and they're just kind of traveling the the war zone, profiteering and thieving along the way. Okay. I'm aiming right now. Okay. And they're shouting. They're shouting in uh, shouting in Polish. When I look around, what is my best escape slash cover area if I need to <laughs> decide this plan? Uh, to fall back to, to where Tonka Truck is there behind that rock is probably your closest. Okay. Because a, a rock, Let's like, give you... they're, they're not going to shoot you through the rock. You, like, as according to the rules, is when that, that rock symbol or whatever that terrain type is on the map like it's you're you're fine you're high gotcha. behind that if i start like kind of turning my horse around does it look like they're still yelling at me or do they yeah like... i'm gonna say okay pickles and melisna Mal uh you understand they're saying like stop stop soldier put your put your hands up drop your drop your weapon put your hands up well, how do they can't see it's porn 
you're not super close either. DVD. You're just holding up DVDs. They don't know. <laughs> how is it a weapon? <laughs> Think about holding up a DVD case. That's what I'm how basically many, showing 10, a bunch 20, of topless 30, women. 40, 40 to 50 meters away from them, and you're holding up. <laughs> Porn we never said what type of porn it was. We I will. We never said that. I will put the. I will try and like put the porn on my like the horse where my legs are, and I'll put my hands up. <laughs> what? Oh, like down. Like in, dropping like on the it. Saddle. Yeah, yeah. So it's not like I can't put it. In, I can't reach in my oh, you pockets. Don't understand. Like so you're just gonna put your hands up? Okay, you put your hands up. I mean, they're just yelling at me. I'm still trying to be. If I didn't say it, I'm prone. Okay. <laughs> All right. Does their does their inflection change at all, or does it still seem like they're? Yeah, no, they're yeah. still shouting. Uh, and again, Pickles and Melisna, you're hearing just drop your weapon, drop your weapon, don't come any closer. American soldier, stop! Oh, was that in, was that in still in Polish? Yeah, it's all in Polish. Okay. I guess I'll just turn around then and leave. Okay. <laughs> okay. Just right away. Yeah, I'll just like ride. I'll just do like a little loop de loop and go back up behind the trees and come next to Tonka. Okay. So, uh, didn't really work there, <laughs> bud. <laughs> <laughs> that that kind of sucked. Hey, what? well, you know, no, I gotta be honest no. with you. My Polish isn't that great. <laughs> and, uh, they thought it, I think they thought it was a weapon, but I was just flashing some boobs, but it didn't really go. It didn't go so well. So, you right, know, well, if you want to, like, take a shot or something... We got, yeah, we gotta get through. Other guys. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We gotta get through. Um, I'll, uh... Melis Melisna nods, and then he pulls out his RPG. Yeah, okay. and I'll give him, like, the thumbs up. I'm sure he yeah. doesn't know our army's signature. Uh, okay, you, do, do we have a... Anyone have an eye on Pickles? For the same for the same purpose to, you know... Melisna, mm -hmm. I guess, can... Bullet, yeah. Trigger the... And I'll pull out I my know, gun. I know that he's... Here. I know that he's to my... You know, he's, he's near Oh, this me, guy's moving? Woods. Yeah, so when you start riding back, Finn, three they you hear see them talking to one another and three soldiers and he and the one yeah. who's shouting at you, Finn, points and three of them hop yeah. over the sandbags yeah. and they start uh heading down the get, road to investigate. Give me some of the give me I some shoot. of that initiative card, please. Yeah. <laughs> well yeah, yeah. Ooh, and they're if there's three of them pulling away. Yeah. Look, are you guys are too busy job. talking about uh, RPGs. I was just trying to role yeah. play, Matt. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> so I, I you know, I moved things along. <laughs> Uh, well, that's the blast radius of C, come on. just so I'm, everyone I'm, knows. Yeah. I'll tell you what. I That's almost an ambush. That's almost, I'm I'm on the fence, Jeff, because I'm, I'm you guys, prone, they tip your hat. They my do scope, know, ready they to do shoot. know Finn rode off in that direction. They watched Finn oh, ride off yeah, in that sure. direction. Yeah, just give me a, a bonus, maybe. <laughs> <laughs> don't have to be a total ambush. Is, is Mike in the game here? What is this? <laughs> so... I'm just saying. I'm, I'm just... <laughs> That far away from shooting. So, These guys are. Oh, 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 they, they. We could roll like opposed recons, and if we succeed, whoever does gets like like the ambush. Like we would get the first cards in initiative. Yeah. So, yeah. So I mean, I, Finn wouldn't be able to, but the rest of us haven't like haven't noticed us yet. So. Yeah, but when you do group recon, the person with the lowest, lowest. score rolls for your group. We actually had some pretty good ones, didn't we? Who's the lowest? D six. I'm a D six. Oh, okay. Yeah, and I, I mean, I can't roll because I'm not really, like... Okay. Do you want to do... Well, I, I like that idea. I like that idea, Jeff. Do you guys want to do a group recon versus yeah, I think their so. recon? Or I mean, because we roll? really are in an ambush we just did, what, with him success, leading right? in. Yeah. But you got to beat them. Yeah, you have to... Right. So it's just... It's Melisna's... All right, let's do I it. Must... Well, yes. Who's... Uh, <laughs> bro, yes. So recon, uh, that's do we have to do what, a group recon empathy? though? Like, is that is that like a, like a must? Like, we have to do it, or can we individually do it? When you're sneaking as a group, the lowest guy has to roll. Yeah, yeah I thought yeah, this when you're sneaking side by side, but we kind of like we kind of right. fanned out. You know? Right. <laughs> well, technically, this would be side by side, isn't it? Because it's on the battle map. It's not. It's not large journey hex. It's okay. battled hex. I think. Okay. I'm not sure. I don't know. Make the call, Matt. You got yeah, it. Yeah, we're doing we're doing a group recon. Okay. Then yeah, it's Melisna. Interesting. All right, Melisna. Blam. Ooh. Oh, that's there we pretty go. good. What'd you get? How many successes? A nine One, and a six. Two. two successes. Sweet. All right, all right. Let's see what uh, the GM's got here. Fuck your marauders, man. Uh, that doesn't look good. I got one success. So you get the drop on them. You when when you win an ambush, it means you automatically get the one initiative. Card. I get the one initiative. Off, yes. Kick off. 
combat. We actually all get them. Since right. We're group. We should There's have like one, two, one, five. Two. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know if Finn would count towards that or not. Come on, man! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we'll give Finn five. Nice. So what we'll do is, I, I'm not even going to put the combat tracker up. We just know every round, the five of you go first, and then they'll go. There's no just, point in even so, putting a tracker. So Matt, page 66 okay. yep. on the PDF <laughs> has the explosions. <laughs> and yes. the RPG mods are on 69. Okay. Now, I start with my RPG. Let me just check here. Let me do You guys talk amongst yourselves. Blast damage. It yeah, is I'm just taking a shot. Yeah. Rate of fire 1, damage 7, crit 2, blast C, range wow. 6. So I'm actually in perfect range. I'm within short. I'm not attacking any of the soldiers specifically. I'm aiming at the truck. Yeah, yeah. And then it's just going to dissipate out from there. Exactly, and it should go three three hexes in a in a full circle. That's like everybody. Light yes, him up. it sure is. The only problem is Viper, but he's but he's behind. He actually did the smart thing, and he's behind he, a bunch of rocks. He is behind cover. That's yeah, penetrable cover. Like I said earlier, you can't shoot through that. Yeah, you can't. So you're gonna hit everybody. Look at you, RPG. Uh, who wants to go first? Do you want Ken to get this shot off? Does yeah, Sniper want to go? What do we want right to do? Ahead. He might as well, yeah, he might as well go. He's going to do the He's most. And yeah, I mean, pick, it would be like simultaneously, you know. You got to take aim, don't you? Give everybody the nod. Uh, you could do a fast for aim. I could do a fast for aim. It's a fast and a slow, so it's an aim. Which yeah, is, aim what shoot. is aim? Plus one? No. No, aim no, it's no just minus. It's just get nothing. No yeah. minus. Yeah. Uh, okay. It's just so a just straight roll. roll. You don't get any ammo dice. For it's RPGs. not a straight roll because I, I actually go through cover. I go through a bunch of different terrain types. So I get a minus two, I think. Oh, because oh, you're shooting through trees and yeah. stuff? Minus, yeah. So you're I, correct. Minus two. So I get a minus two. Um, but you don't have any ammo dice when you use RPGs. I think I get one. Mm, maybe you're right. We'll just call that. Yeah, it's rate of fire one, so. And it, you just you expend that when you shoot. Yeah, yeah. Good call, good call. Oh, yeah, because I have to reload. That's right. You have to reload every yeah. time. Um, okay. Okay. Heavy ammos don't. Heavy weapons don't use ammo dice. Each shot counts as one round. So. And heavy weapon is under strength for some reason. Oh, that makes yeah. sense. And I do... You what hang I said, on to that steps. thing when you launch a rocket at a Yeah, truck. I know, right? I, know. I mean, what are all those squats for, bro? <laughs> and I said two, two steps <laughs> down, right? Correct. Yeah, for yes. terrain is what you said. Yes. So that means I get only one D10. Yikes! Got a forty percent push. Chance. Bam! Ooh, you oh. did it. Six. Melisna doesn't need to push. Rocket flies through the air, slams into the pickup truck. Apparently, this is happening. All right, let's figure this out. I didn't know this was gonna happen first combat, but apparently. Well, you know, we tried to be negotiators, and it just didn't work. Uh, all right, so let's figure out this explosion damage. You said it was on page 66? 66, yeah. This is probably going to be pretty So nuts. the the base, the the like squ the truck itself, and the guy who's on the, the sp I space see, of the truck machine gun fire. takes the full brunt of the damage, right? So what's your blast power? Yeah, I was just going to say. You're you said it was a C? So that's 2d8. So go ahead and roll 2d8. C? Yep, C. So okay, it's going to cool. it's gonna go cool. all the way to here. Let's... Yeah. So roll right. me 2d8. Because so, yeah. that's what the, the truck and the guy on the, on the square of the truck is going to take. Yes. Wow. It's 13 on top of the initial three. Base damage I got like Jeremy energy right oh, no, now. Base damage is two. Grenades. <laughs> yeah. So 15 points of damage. Woo, woo, woo. That's the wow. Okay, so fifteen. 15. Damage. So it's not fifteen points of damage. Those are so it's it should be two dice of these. Like it depends if he's throwing or if he's or if he's shooting. Like there should be a base base damage for the grenade or for the weapon. So I know right. like a throwing grenade, like uh, like at sea level has a blast power of two. So it does two damage. Two damage. Yeah. And those two would be successes. So he's got like two successes, which means he can now do three damage because he's got an extra success. Otherwise, gotcha. they would all be dead. Gotcha. They're Thank all, you. Like, you know, families. So you're rolling a hit, and then you're doing the damage. Okay, gotcha. That makes yeah. sense. Um, yeah. So that is three points of damage. 
It's not gonna kill that guy. Why don't you <laughs> roll a roll a um, roll a hit location? Roll a D6. Where's uh where's the RPG uh ammo I hate to, that I hate was... to be this guy, but do any of them have light cover? <laughs> like this guy and that kind of stuff. Because light cover will will if Oh it has no effect. Never mind, there's no effect against explosions. Yeah, it's solid cover. There. And you shot at the truck oh, okay. that the guy was using as cover, so he's yeah, not going to help yeah, yeah. him whatsoever. Shot... Exactly. They also yeah. should have plus one armor. Yes. Also, I hate to be that. No, no. No, it's that's not... the, well, that's right, the thing. Is we're, 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 right. Yeah, we're learning. It's like you got to figure out all the extra stuff. Yeah. So, now, so I'm rolling for damage, which is, what did I say, three? You don't. You, you don't. Three. So you got three yeah. points of damage. So yeah. everyone gets three who is affected. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, that's right. Um, and then you so... roll... Yeah, everybody in the whole square. Holy crap! Damn. Uh, so, so, it's 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 blast power C. So only the actual hex where it lands gets full damage. The next round of hexes around it would get damage minus one. So, so it'd be two, two and, then one. and then one. And then and then it's nothing. So it's only because okay. if it's a blast power C, it's only like those that little radius. Got it. Got it. Got it. So it's gonna hit. Yeah. So this is one. And then these two guys are two. Whoa. Whoa. Hey, look, you can I make... keep drawing. So here, let's drop yeah. it right here. Right. You can just, right, Why click the other ones and more? delete, and they'll go away. You should be able to just to pull it. Yeah. Yeah. So ping where your, your widest point is. Are you got it there? Are you doing it? Well, that was me. Yeah, because those will do right. Perfect. There we go. So, yep. Matt, th these guys don't have any special armor on them? No, they're not wearing any okay. armor whatsoever. So they all get one just from the effect. So it should be the guy in, like on the actual square where he threw it should be taking two damage, and these two should be taking one damage. One damage. Yeah. And the guy furthest away gets nothing. Shouldn't get anything because of the radius isn't big enough. Okay. Perfect. Thank you. Nice. Is there a uh, that's, music? Yeah, you go up to the music. Just click on them, and then they should have a slider. That top playlist is the okay, your main I'm volume. You gotta go to now playing on the bottom. Okay. You can also just mute mute your tab. Uh, you get no, to roll. I don't mind uh, somebody who's just all the way up. I was looking in settings for. A, roll an injury location for everybody you hit, please, Jeff. Ooh. D6. Well, let us know. Ken. Ken, yeah. Ken, thank you. It's cool. You want a six. So, one, I, two, I'm gonna three, just, four. Yeah. Four targets. I was going to say, I'm just going to roll 4D6. Five. Five targets, sorry. There's one six. Nice. I'm going to hover over these damn things. We got a three, a six, a five. A one and a two. One and a two. Okay, we're just gonna go do them clockwise. We'll start with the guy in the middle. So you rolled a three for him. Three is the torso. So go ahead, you click that bullseye button next to where it says public roll. You can click injuries and then just hit torso and it'll automatically do the roll table for what injury you gave. Him. Oh, nice, cool. nice, nice. Let's do some debilitating, <sighs> debilitating injuries. That's right. That makes sense, Ken. No. So where's my tables at? So right next to the drop-down menu that says like public role, private role. To right the left, left of that, of there's that, like a bullseye. There's a bullseye. Yeah. Click that bullseye. Click it, injuries. And then it'll say hazards. Oh, injuries. I see it. Click injuries and then just click torso. Sorry and about I put that. The, it's I all good. It. I put the roll tables in here. One. Nice. Ooh, snapped collarbone. Not fatal. Snapped collarbone. Mobility minus one. Wah wah. That sounds painful, though. Yeah. All right, roll me. Pain um, doesn't matter. There's no minuses for pain. The next one is a six. Be the next guy. So that Oops, is a headshot. headshot. So roll me a head injury. Oh, Gouge, die, eyeball. fatal. Range combat and recon is a minus two. It's a permanent injury. So you shot. This guy got shrapnel, flew up, and hit him in the eye. Nice. Okay. Uh, the next one is a five. He's not so that's the arm. Anything. Dislocated what? elbow, two-handed weapons cannot be used. Now, is when you take out. it, he's 
when you're hitting the arm for an injury, you drop what you have in your hands, right? And when you're right. hitting the leg, you fall you down. Fall yep. Okay. So he drops his AK. Or whatever yeah, this, this is going to be a game that you have to like really sink your teeth into and like oh, play yeah. the sessions because like already I'm like I would I'm gonna have to re I didn't expect to use the RPG as quickly as I did I didn't and it's expect like, for you to do it was it perfect as fast. oh that was well, great you gave us like a freaking hail mary you know like you did a layup it was just like so easy yeah well I mean I would so? say bringing pornos to a gunfight is a layup but <laughs> hey you would think so right. Maybe again. if I spoke Polish, they would have, you know, been more yeah, that might help, accepting of the porn. I can't either. All right. Uh, what's your next one? Your next one is a one. So one. one. Legs, I think. The legs? Yes. Ooh. Bleeding thigh. Running is a slow action. Mobility minus two. This, this dude's out too. Yeah, yeah that he guy drops done. prone. Yep. Okay. And, and it, two. Last one is a two. Or so. Oh! <laughs> Whoa! Cracked spine, fatal. Spine fatal. Fall down, immobile. That guy. So fatal. Is they do actually die from it, right? Out. Like, not instantly. They no, die. No, forty-six. Uh, they can die. Healing time. You can Shit. heal that person. Um, wow. Oh, fuck that guy. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Now they all have to see was... after all of this stuff if they are suppressed. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I think they're suppressed. I mean, come on. What's their cuff roll? Their cuff roll, Matt. Oh yeah, the cool under fire. I'll make the yeah. cool under fire here. Hold on, I got that. Coof. Oh, now, did you hit? Did that explosion go off near the other RPGs that are there? Jesus. Yeah, that's what I was gonna. Ask. That's what I was trying to say when he said only did two damage. Uh, well, like, did he Matt blow did say they the pulled ammo? it out of the truck, <laughs> and I shot the truck. That's what I was trying to say. That it I blew up. D six on my GM side. Why is that going? Ah, uh, they failed their coof roll. They are not coof right now. So they are they are suppressed. They did not pass their cool under fire. So all those all guys right. are suppressed. I'm just it's it's a group action. So I'm just gonna say it spreads. It spreads to those other guys in front of the main one. Um, so they're they are currently suppressed. Okay. Who who's? Oh, I see. So really, the lead guy is probably the the biggest threat right now. The other guys on the ground prone. The other guys, the guys are the fatally further, injured. Further back, there are guys that weren't um, that weren't but, hit. Um, this, this guy right here, though, probably smarter to take out the closest that aren't prone. Yeah, no, that guy that's wasn't supposed too... to be injured. I marked him incorrectly. He was fine. Okay. Um, I'm gonna take a shot unless someone else it makes I'm going sense. Last, someone so else to go. Do whatever you want. Take a shot. Uh, take a okay. shot, Jeff. Um. So am I taking any? I don't. I mean, I got a straight line to him. I don't, or is there any negatives for that? Uh, what are you firing through for? Oh, he's the guy out in the open. This guy right here. Yeah, you're shooting yeah. him. No, it's a clear shot. Uh, okay, so. Let's um, be a minus one for the range. Okay. Um, now I, 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 I mentioned I was taking s sniper aim. Is that cool, or do I need to do that this first round and then? I mean, since we're in I'll an ambush an situation, ambush you, but typically okay. you have to, you have to. Right, it's going to be a next round thing. Yeah. Okay. So, what's the range on your on your gun? Twelve is oh. short. So oh, short. Oh, short. short. Yeah, there's no negative. Just yeah. shoot. Right. So I'll get a plus two for the sniper aim. So I should have two 12s and then a six for the ammo die. That doesn't look very good. No. Well, uh, one success. Seven. Yeah, I didn't... Oh, you're... we had a one, though, on the ammo, right? Is that How bad? come you're... you don't have... Did you not do your attribute plus your... Your skill? You I should have, have had two twelves. Yeah, two D twelve. My tribute is a twelve, and then my skill went. Yes. Well, actually, went beyond a twelve. Truth, oh, I, okay. I might have All right. added you're, another. You're not, you can't commit ammo dice, right? That's right. Is right. that correct? Okay. I have one ammo die. So my rate you, of fire if, is one. If you went above a D twelve, you should get an I extra should, D six. I should have rolled an extra D six to. So run, roll one more yeah, D six. Just a hit. It's not the ammo. Right, just a hit. Right. 
All right. Okay. So, so I got one hit. Yeah. So that's Firm three, uh, three damage. He's got no armor. And and so that's a so that's a critical hit. Yeah. Because when you roll equal to or above, um, and then I didn't get two ones, so I don't have a malfunction. Right. Okay. Um, yeah, he's, it's, it's, it's fatal. You're going to kill him. Okay, so Do you so want to roll your a, hit location? Do you want to know yeah. how, where you kill be him? Nice to, it'd be nice to shoot him in the head, but no, that won't no, work. No, you got a torso. Okay, torso. It's going to go right through his, pardon me, right through his gut. Yeah, you can do call shots. Oh, yeah. oh, you got torn intestines anyway, fatal. But, uh, yeah, so minus two, You literally got him right through the gut. Yeah. Oh, and his guts fly out and he slumps to the ground and they're all shouting in Polish screaming alright nice it's a musical language yeah it really is <laughs> alright all right. I'm done who wants to go next we've had the RPG and the sniper go oh, I'm to go back if you want to go Jeff time to mop up um so the guy in front is is dead he is dead okay. dead dead that's the one that uh, Tonka just killed I can't even see what's going on up front. Okay. <laughs> and so... All right. That's, I love the fog of war. <laughs> okay. I just hear gunfire <laughs> explosions. Yeah. Uh, I'm going to throw a grenade. Uh, basically... Love this. Love this plan. <laughs> right, right, just ping. <laughs> the plan's <laughs> terrible, but it's working so out. Bad. So grenades Don't have to bad. be thrown at short range, so you're, you're good for It this. is short range, Okay, yeah. perfect. It's just... So it's within three. I have three. Okay, perfect. Uh, so do I get, uh, for terrain, what, what penalty would you give me for this? Uh, it's a minus... Oh, where's my terrain type here? Oh, I put... You know what? I put it in the game. Imagine that. Sparsely wooded. Let me go over to the... Yeah, it's, looks like sparsely wooded. 56 in the PDF. <laughs> Uh, that is, well, it's forest, so range attacks, movement, cover minus, it's minus one. Okay. Minus one. So then that'll be a D10 and a D6. Yeah. Okay. All right, Pickles. Nobody right, has here we failed go. to roll yet? Well, I guess it's just scratch. Why'd you have to say that before I roll? Yeah. Why did you have to? <laughs> That's totally unnecessary. <laughs> Uh, Ooh, right. that should be a six. That's, okay, I got that's one. That's all you need. That's all you I got, need. I got the one. All right. So, yeah. Wind up. Throw a grenade. Falls right at its intended target, which is that guy mm -hmm. there. Correct. Yep, that's correct. And it's right. it's the same as as same damage as, as sort of as Ken's grenade. So it's a C, C yes. blast power. Two D eight. Um, we gotta look and look and see if there's explosions in this in the foundry. <laughs> All right. well, oh, that's hinted. really good, though. It was because that means cover is ignored totally. It was hinted at this morning that they are looking at Foundry for this this game. Oh, so they need to. It should be yeah. three damage onto this guy. Oh my god. Yep. And then two onto the ones on the outskirts. Okay. The dead guy gets chewed up even more. Uh, they're not wearing any armor. It goes it goes right through. They eat real, all the damage. Real quick, uh, referee doesn't need to roll separately for each NPC hit by an explosion. Instead, they roll once for all the NPCs at the same distance from the blast and apply the result. I just want to make sure. For the crit? I think we're... Uh, for all explosions. I think you mean for injury, right? Or is that what you yeah, mean? For, for yeah, blast, for blast damage. Okay. Cool. Just, okay, I think I think we we're flip. I think we we're flip flopping, and I just wanted to make sure it was clear because I just found it. Cool. cool. Um. Yeah, you're, you're gonna kill them. Do you want to roll for an injury and see how you kill them? It's up to you. Uh. No. Let's just say they're, they they're they, dead. they went into pieces. <laughs> they fell to explosion. pieces. Yes. They fell to pieces. It's very sad. Um. I'm sorry. Those are your right. countrymen. They, no, those were my countrymen. <laughs> Not anymore. <laughs> Put on Art the squad. old film filter here. It's like an old war movie. Yes, the so war yeah, filter. That's what I'm talking about. Do you like that? That's cool. All right. Uh, okay, who wants to go next? What are the two dudes in the back doing that I can see? Uh, they have AK-47s out, out, and they are shouting and panicking. Uh, let me see where your token is. I need to look on my GM layer to see where exactly you are, where you can see. Uh, i got to refresh my game. It's acting funky oh. for me. I can't no, select I any of your tokens on the, the GM side. I'm right there. Uh, 
Oh, you know why? It's got me logged in on both as a player. Oh. Um. I can't see Oak. The. The center. I just the do whatever you gotta rock, do, man. The biggest center rock formation. I'm right south of it. Can you draw a line with the? He's just the right ruler? here. Just show me who you can, can see. You see the pain? Yeah, but I can't see you behind the rock. He sees the two people in the back. Yeah, I see this. The guy, guy by the tree and the guy next to him. This guy. Yeah. That's all I can see. Okay, well then that's who you can see. This, what these guys. That's I'm gonna I'm move. Yeah. Oh, heaven over there. Okay. They're just freaking out though. Yeah, they're yelling. They got their guns. They're pointing up ahead. Uh. Two, three. How four. four and one. Two, two spaces. Two. Two. Unless you roll mobility. And then you can hook it. Uh, Is anyone wearing backpacks in this? Did we all just ignore? We're like, yeah, we no, don't. No, we said we, we, said we took them off with the horses. Off. Yeah, yeah. I want to move up one here, mm -hmm. and I'm gonna be yelling like in Polish. You are surrounded. Drop weapons or I'll die. So you're gonna try and persuade them? Yeah. All right. You get Except one the shot. Porno. Except the porno. <laughs> <laughs> Give me a second here. I'm trying to log back in. One guy's chair. finally like yeah. just shaking, takes the porno and leaves. Take the porno. <laughs> <laughs> just don't kill me. <laughs> there we go. Now I can see on my screen. Okay, so you're gonna the try battle and persuade... of Porno Hill. Yeah. You're gonna try and persuade those two. All right. Um. Hmm. <laughs> I'm just yelling out for any of them that can hear. Yeah. Yeah. Does your guys speak Polish? Yeah. Yeah. I'm a double agent. Okay. As far as you know, I am Polish. It's true. It's true. Uh, you can do a command roll. And I'll give you a plus. Now, if you don't have anything in, in the skill itself, what do you default to? Empathy. Just, Just the attribute. Just empathy. So I will give you a, uh, a plus yeah, say, two. Okay. Because they they they've seen their buddies fall yeah. dead. Yeah, you've blown up the truck. A whole bunch of them lying dead. So I'll give you a plus two to your roll. You're okay. gonna you're gonna so, get a little bit of an advantage on it. But here. with no skill die, you just get one roll. Just your. It just defaults to your base. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Now, what about manipulation? Would that play into? No. Okay. So I've got a C in empathy. And so it's now you have an A. Two. Right. D twelve, baby. D twelve. Yeah, Will this be our first push roll of the night? Probably. Keep saying it. One. I know. I'm not pushing hey. shit. Ten. <laughs> double success. Um, nice, man. Double Hell rainbow yeah. all, all right. the way. It is, oh, yeah. it, is, it, is, it is an opposed roll. They're going to get to roll. It's, it's opposed. Let's not celebrate just yet, fellas. <laughs> but they're so uncool under fire right now. They yeah. are. Two huge explosions. No, Taking totally out easy. half of them. Where, why did it show Jenkins? What's going on here? Well, they did get one success. No, it's only supposed to be one d six. I don't know why it rolled two. Uh oh. Uh, yeah. They uh, you hear them shout back in Polish. Stop shooting! Stop shooting! We surrender! We surrender! And you see them like put their guns down slowly on the ground and raise their hands up. Everybody sees that. Like multiple people or just those two? Multiple. Dudes? It's it's spreading. After you guys have just blown away their little. Their little roadside. I'll, I'll come out from behind the if there's if I still have. I mean, I moved mm -hmm. up there and then yelled that. If I can't do anything, it's cool. Otherwise, I'm gonna be coming out with my pistol drawn, aimed at the first guy. Uh, you can't do anything else this this okay. round. Does anybody else want to do something? There, you you can yeah, all see that they're dropping their weapons. I will uh, <laughs> gallantly, like a royal knight, come out on my horse. Branson. <laughs> With Naked, porno still in my hand, <laughs> and just like kind of giving like a you could have avoided this <laughs> look. Look at your face, character. Look at this smug sob. <laughs> Melissa is gonna reload if we're allowed to do a, a, a sure long action. Okay, I will. I will try to reload. like tell them like pantomime throwing your weapons on the ground, like all of J them. Like. You reload, Jennings. You come around the corner with your pistol out, trained on them. You see that they're all putting their weapons down and surrendering. The truck is gone. It's just like a smoldering mess uh, that's sitting there now. And um, the remaining one, two, three, four soldiers 
uh, put their hands up and uh, they surrender. Yeah, tell them to back, be using the pistol and point like back away from the weapons and stuff. Yep, they all do so. I'll start policing up all the weapons. We can cut the shooting sounds. Okay, yeah, you can start scooping up their weapons. And uh, they are all like, I don't know, whatever you're telling them to do, lining up along the tree line or whatever it is you tell them yeah, to do. Yeah, we should, we should tell them to line up face down on the, on the road. Oh, come on, man. That seems a little extreme, you know? it's uh, They just got blown up. All their friends World, got World blown War to III, pieces. buddy. Yeah, but World we're trying to, you know, turn a new leaf. We're just going to a monastery looking for some alcohol. Who are you working for? Why are you here with ambush? <laughs> what? Oh, you're talking to them? He's yeah. talking to them. <laughs> oh, I thought you were talking. I thought you were talking to the commanding turn, officer. Yeah, turn our guns on each other. <laughs> <laughs> no. I, I want to go back and get horses and all the gear we stowed as, sure. as this conversation's going on. I'm bringing everyone's stuff up. Melissa's gonna uh, pat down the soldiers for cigarettes. Sure. <laughs> sure. They they say we are we are members of the shepherd's flock. We work for no one. Uh, we are looking for a prison nearby. You have directions. Prison. Uh, are you speaking of the one to the south of here? And that's where your coordinates are um, are pointing towards. Yes, you have intel. You know how many people there are you basing out of there? Oh, here they make very of... excellent alcohol. Very good stuff. You've been there. Uh, there's a rumor. Everyone has heard of this on the... Out in the zone. But have you been there? I have not been there. We we hear tales of excellent liquor and a madman who has visions of God running this place. Ask him uh, if there's more of the, you know, his folk on the roads and stuff. And if there's a way, you know, obviously not poor, no, but we could try and talk to them and not have to blow them all up next time. You have other... he, sa he said to the GM. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, Party Wipe Games with the uh, raid. Thank you so much for raiding us. Are there uh, more of your uh, fellow soldiers, your uh, shepherds, set up around here? And where are they? Not. We wish to say, avoid conflict like this. They say no, not as uh, not as far as we are. In, we know we are the only regiment in this area. Were we given any instructions specifically to? The shepherds. I mean, just. No. I mean, was it okay? You can kill okay. these guys if you want. Well, that, that's what I meant. If yeah, we you were, can. You can execute if we were told them. To uh, you do, that would be a coup de gras, though, if you wanted to. Execute well, them. no. Okay, I was just wondering if we were told to kill them all, or just kill when needed, or you know. No, if, I just if, to if know the opportunity, if, if the situation comes up and it's going to be, right. you know, compromising the mission, you're 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 free to okay. open fire. These well, okay. guys, uh, Polish, Russians, whatever. Russians are the the your enemy here, but these guys. What time, are you, what time of year is it again? Um, we'll say it's summer. Okay. Did uh, we blow up the RPG ammo? Oh yes, you did. Probably. Yes. You yeah. Did. Yeah. There's no salvaging that. Whatever was in the back of that pickup is gone. I was gonna go through their weapons and salvage whatever kind of parts in ammo I can find. From yeah. Them. No, for sure. So on them, you find they all have uh, AKMs. In the book, I don't know if you. That's probably better than what those I are. Know. Those are under the. I think it's yep. under the Polish stats AKMs. They're AK forty sevens. They're Soviet yeah. AK forty seven. They're like rip offs. Um, yeah. And you also find two M seven hundred hunting rifles that they had in the bushes off to the side. Oh. oh okay. Those I think are under the common gear. The M seven hundred. It's just okay. like. M seven hundred. Yeah. A deer that, hunting that's, rifle. Yeah. Okay. Um, and let's roll for some random... The, you will, you find three packs of cigarettes. Very good. I take you're, them. You're gonna find... Five rations. Ooh, nice. And five water. Ooh, that's pretty good. Say, hey, Pickles, can you look at these weapons before we divvy them up? Yes, uh, so you said... Uh... Evan, that your character probably yeah. So I'll I'll say I'll give this I'll, I'll save one of the AKMs for this one, and then I'm going to salvage all the ammo from the others. 
uh, because it's the same ammo that I would use in my gun. Mm. Uh, and then the hunting rifles, you said they were M1700s? M700. M700s. M700s. I could um, use some sort. I've only got a pistol, so I need some sort of long range. Okay. I mean, take the take another AKM if yeah. you want. Um, they're yeah. both assault rifles. I don't know if that's 700. Have. That 700 might be the same ammo that I'm using. It's the 30. The uh, AKMs are 7.2, mm, 7.62. That's oh, that's what. I think they all have one one clip on them. Oh, okay. How, how many total of the AKs were there? There were, oh, how many guys are here? They all had one. One, two, three, four, five, six. We can salvage seven, all the ammo. Right. That's what I'm yeah. going to do. Yeah. There's nine, nine AKs. Yeah. And two hunting right. rifles. Oh, okay. Yeah, and so the M seven hundred is thirty out six. If, yeah, if that's what you were asking. I'll, I'll I'll take one though, just for backup, because it's also they can. It's considered a sniper. The the bonus I have is plus one for sniper and hunting rifles. Okay. So or the skill I mean. And the other thing I can do is I can scavenge. Right. I can like salvage them and break them down into parts and stuff too. That's right. That we don't use. Yeah, so we only need two of them. Yeah, so one AK to. Uh, to Finn, one AK. Uh, to uh, what's your name again? Oak. Can't Viper. 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 Call me Viper. Casper then, is what y'all would know him as. It's yeah. his. Between the three of us, I'll give each of us three three reloads. He's a friendly okay. ghost. Well, it's it's actually a, a, a male Polish name, a popular one. I looked him up, and I'm like, well, Casper also fits a spook. Yeah, that's wicked cool. I love that. Yeah. Is it K or is it a C? It's with a K. It's a. Uh, that's cool. Yeah, yeah. It has to be. Like Constantine is the K. Hey, who doesn't have a binoculars? Oh, I don't have any. Well, we got two M700s. I'm grabbing one for a backup sniper, but there should be a scope on the other one. Yep. That we could pop the scope off. All right. Better than nothing. Yep. All right. You also find a bright yellow raincoat here which gives you plus one stamina against chemical weapons oh. sure they'll help so me next time i try and uh, give the porn away you could stuff it into your backpack like it can be rolled up with it's just a raincoat you also find it. uh um amongst uh, one of the guy's belongings he has an old crime novel that it looks like he, that the pages are all dog-eared and he was reading is it in polish no it's 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 in polish but it's it's over where the uh, latrine is it's the collective <laughs> whatever they go oh. use the toilet it's the, the book they all read. it's an old crime novel um <laughs> melizna takes that because he also takes shits in the wood yeah he's <laughs> squat and he's a man he's a man of culture <laughs> and you also find a ski hat which gives you uh plus one stamina against cold it's got like the little pom-pom on top what's the make of it, who made it? <laughs> no, the make Adidas. <laughs> is it a? Is it? Is there a, like a cat jumping, or is there a swoop, or is there three lines on it? It's Adidas. Adidas. <laughs> you put well, it on. It looks over at his buddy and he's like, <laughs> "I have fine taste." <laughs> yeah. The Marauders. It said we had to kill such smart men. <laughs> I have caught one uh, typo here under the AK-47. They've got it AK-74. I think that's technically supposed to be the AK-74. It's like a, I think they're using like a modern. A smaller round. It's yeah. It's like a 5, 4, 5. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, it's, it's weird, yeah. AK-47 in the description. Oh, if it's different in the description, then it probably is a, a typo. Yeah, there's a couple in there, yeah. All right, so that's what you found on these, these more It's alpha, folks. Alpha. Yep. This is the alpha, folks. That was our first combat. Uh, we worked our way through it. An AP RPG and a grenade really sped things along. Yeah. We completely <laughs> jumped into it, which is like feet first. Yeah, totally. Uh, when, so when it comes to virtual tabletops, I think automation is also going to help. And tracking a lot of this stuff um, when you're able to track the this different couldn't, effects. Yeah, this couldn't be played without a, like an actual battle map. It ha You need one. You know what I mean? Like you can yeah, do theater of the hard, mind yeah. with a lot of like fantasy stuff, ah, but this is yeah. this tactical. is completely tactical. Exactly. Yeah. Tactical. Awesome. All right. So that is we're we're in day now. So you've traveled two shifts. Your your horses, your ponies need a rest. Poor poor Adidas. <laughs> is that your horse's name? They they have any ant or water or anything? Did yeah, you guys got. Yeah, we got four or five waters, oh, okay, five food. All right. Okay. 
I yeah. will hand um, the horse. A, a grenade to uh, Pickles. Oh, here you go, friend. I'll just uh, give you another one. I got a couple more in case you need them. Just, you know, let, just let me know. You have more of these? Oh, but I as do. he does it, Melisna, Melisna holds his hand out <laughs> as oh. he passes it. But, <laughs> but, he, but he misses it, and he, just puts, and, and he just puts his hand back down sadly. <laughs> oh, one for you, one for you. Yeah, I got plenty of these things, believe it or not. <laughs> All right, so you guys can all have one. Um, I have four more hand grenades. So if anyone else wants one, you can let me know. I can give you one. I rolled a six on them, so I was fucking flushed. Oh, okay. Nice. Yeah, that's awesome. All right. So if... um, you want to wait uh, a shift? But if you wait we a will, shift, then it's into night. So we could you could make camp here. It sounds we... like we make camp, yeah. Let's Let's not make camp where they have their camp, though. Well, I'm well, assuming we, we moved a little just bit, in case, right? Yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah you can yeah. move move in, move yeah. away from the scene. We didn't kill the guys, right? We let them just, just run away. Them yeah, go. what do you do with them? Are you tying them up? I was I was going to let them run away. Take, the, take is, their shoes and let them run. That is that is the Polish way. So we take their shoes. <laughs> take their shoes and let them go. Some yeah. Combat boots. There's some Pumas. There's some Adidas. As, the, as they run away, <laughs> Melissa's like, You should have taken the pornos. <laughs> <laughs> Slaps yeah. him on the butt as he goes yeah. by. Uh, we'll just throw the boots in the woods. We don't want them. Just to stop them from traveling quickly. No, that's good eating. Very nice, uh, well, you oh, you can trade off huh? if you need to, you Boy, guys. <laughs> Delicacy. Yeah, the, the the camera slowly pans down to your feet, and you're wiggling your feet in your new shoes. Yeah. <laughs> yeah All right. Camp. Yeah. You want to make Unless, camp? Yeah, somewhere. Can we try and find somewhere like off the beaten path, not quite on the road? You know, yeah, we got to roll for right. it. Right. And some rocks. To roll for make yeah. camp. Survival, I think. Right? Oh man, I can't do anything. Yeah, make camp is a survival. And we can get, <laughs> I think okay. we can get mishaps for make camp. I got a B and a D. Ooh, that's me and C. Okay, it's yeah, better. Yeah, we get camp hazards. It's, be if you it's guys... between the leaders. Yeah, Melisna is basically useless. Now, is there a, assisting someone? Oh, you I'm your buddy. Assist someone. You can. Um, Jeff's your buddy too. Yeah. It yeah. it upgrades it by one step. You can do it to a maximum of plus three. Oh, we can um, double assist you. Look yeah, at there that. you go. Because it's your buddy, the two of you are wandering through the woods together and helping each other out. I'll give you an additional plus one, so it'll be a plus two to your roll. Yeah, right. Nice. You gonna roll, Jeff, or you want me to? No, go you're ahead. Rolling. You're the yeah, better yours one. better. Yeah. I got a B and a C, so it's gonna. Uh, you're gonna your C will become an A. A. You got an A and an A. It gave you plus three, right? No, well, I think it's just two. Plus two. Oh, okay. Plus two. Okay, yeah. So it's two twelves. One for the right. assist and no, one, one ten, one twelve. Your, your yeah, one ten, one twelve. I'm sorry. Ah, uh, yes, those dice codes, super Ooh, helpful. That's pretty good. <laughs> Six and a twelve. Wow, Ooh, three boy. successes. You got like the perfect camp. I'm gonna say you On find an in. old. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> you find like an old like um like pillbox. Uh, mm -hmm. that hasn't been used for quite some time and it's under a lot of cover and it looks like nobody's really seen this thing. It's, it's perfectly camouflaged for the night. You can put your horses and they'll be out of sight and you guys could like safely set up a fire and a camp in there. You could cover over nice. the entrance and the windows and you, you're completely um, secluded and safe from the elements in there. Can we attempt this looks to like Dracula's lair. I sleep outside. <laughs> well, your choice, it's friend. You know, we're not going to force you. Uh, can we try and mark this on the map or something? Like, yeah. So yeah, if we were playing a, a real campaign, this would be a good thing to actually. Okay, mark we'll on just the map say to we to, in our head. Come yeah. back to again. I agree. That yeah, is we'll a just keep idea. a watch, obviously. Yeah, yeah. Who's taking what watches? Yeah. No sleeping oh, during watch. Oh shit. <laughs> Maybe we should do uh, do two person watches. You know what? No, no. You know what? You can say you want to take a watch, but you had three successes. I'm, I'm like you guys are like really, really concealed in cover. I'm gonna give you those bonuses, and you're, you're not gonna have to stay up and, and take watches tonight, based off of the um, the rolls you made for finding this this camp. Nice. Three three successes is really good. That's a lot. Man. Yeah. yeah. Um, They'll be too watch. scared from the the combat. We also yeah, be those nice. shoeless uh, Polish marauders running around. Yeah. Scared I got my what? first my first check on the. Oh, the rifle. One down. Oh, a little notch. <laughs> one one down. Shoot a gun. He, he scrapes it, it into the porno. <laughs> yeah, there you go. 
I think I think Pickles has the highest kill count right now, though. No. Oh, I don't. I know that. They, they're mass kills. Yeah. Uh, I, have, I, have, I have, like, don't use that phrase in World War Three. We like to we like to make it sound. <laughs> you a make it sound friendly. kills. Yeah. yeah. I'm you don't use be... the word mass, mass in the military. Yeah. I'm gonna be breaking down like every... he, I have like all of, all He's... the weapons on my lap, and I'm just breaking them apart. He's the like, one playing shot with Legos. Kill. Yeah. <laughs> like playing with Legos. <laughs> because in Poland, you know, we've had war constantly, so that is Legos to us. Yeah. World War Three has been very difficult on the toy industry. <laughs> <laughs> all right, so you guys rest of the night. Very uneventful. You're in a perfect little hidey hole. Uh, you wake up in the morning refreshed. And ready to uh, keep heading on towards the former prison, now monastery. So, we choose our roles again, and uh, we start making our way across the uh, the war zone. You know, this really march. doesn't remind me of home at all. It's actually very different. <laughs> what? Oh, my, my character has nothing to do whenever I, we're traveling. I, well, you need a very <laughs> specific... Stare it so off of there. He just... <laughs> He just like talks like nonsense and like tells old like borderline Canadian like wood stories and I saw a moose once. Is there any modifiers on the no. recon? No, you're good. Straight recon. Six. Ooh, and got two. one. All right. Six. Nice. Yeah. All right. Uh, does anybody want to do any scrounging or anything like that uh, as you're also going? Um. You're free. You're free to hunt, scrounge, whatever you want. There's. It's all survival, right? We we farmed the bodies of this land. <laughs> well, that's the thing. Like as you're moving along, you can find things and along the way. Oh, technically, uh, yeah, technically I'll, we have I'll to scrounge. eat a bunch of food and drink water and stuff. Yeah, one okay. a day, one of each a day. One a day. Yeah, one of each right. a day. You guys okay. just made out like bandits, uh, so you got. Some all right, food so we gotta mark that. Really okay. Worried about just take it off of whatever the group was we just found. Yeah, yeah. That's that my that roll? holy that's crap. That's your scrounge, scrounge roll. I'm gonna scrounge, but it's gonna be with the hunting rifle, not my. If we choose to scrounge, it means we don't move forward. It means that he goes ahead of us. Oh, does it? Choose it's to not what? scrounging scrounge. along the way. I'm fairly certain that it it, it uh. You can't. It, the only thing that happens at the same time is march and uh, keep watch. And the other thing with scrounge is that either if several characters want to do it, either we do different hexes each time we shift yeah. to a different hex, or it's like a like you it's like an assist roll or whatever. Gotcha. You spend a shift scrounging. Okay. Gotcha. Yeah, I think yeah. the I think the idea is that whatever you do, it has to be purposeful. Right. Like you're never just walking and doing stuff. Okay. Like you're always like, okay. we gotta scrounge. You know what nope, I mean? That makes That's sense. cool. Okay. We could have scrounged in the morning and then. Yeah, you yeah. guys did Travel have an extra shift when shift. you made camp, so uh, yeah. we'll we'll just backtrack and do it for that because you guys did stop okay. at evening and there was evening and night left. That um, depends on our terrain too. So go ahead and roll me two d one hundreds, please. Yeah, we'd have a minus one. Sixty one and sixty four. Wow. <laughs> More CDs. <laughs> yeah. These are music. Ones. You know they really are missed they? The, yeah. the to put the uh, porno on sixty nine. Six, yeah, sixty one is a is a mirror. And <laughs> they really. Is, you're right, hundred percent. They should need good. to change it. The porno needs to go to sixty nine. Uh, you got. Can you what, send that six, in the alpha? Six CDs, six <laughs> music CDs, all Polish classics. Okay, but, the, but there was what a was mirror too. Yeah, there was a mirror. A mirror. Yeah. Okay. Like a hand we mirror. should should be able to use that awesome. for signaling. Yeah. Signaling. Yeah. yeah. And dude. cocaine. And there, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's really well, you know, we only got baby powder right now, but uh, maybe yeah. we'll find some. Yeah. And and baby powder so that explains things. Oh my yeah. god! <laughs> only thing we yeah. have to find is hookers. Yeah. <laughs> oh, we got the porno. I mean, it's close. All right, so let's let's uh, travel right. on. So you you press on, and um, Viper, as you're coming along. Uh, ahead of you, you uh, manage to see something again. You see in a, there's a clearing, and um, in the clearing you see a farm. There's a barn. Its doors are open and kind of clang against the side as the wind blows it. Uh, there's a house near the uh, near the barn. Uh, its windows are all open, uh, but you don't see any signs of activity. Say, so I'll watch it for a little while with binoculars just to make sure it seems clear. 
Sure, make me a recon plus two for the binoculars. Recon plus two. Recon. Well, so we can only a couple of us sneak up there. Two of us good at sneaking. Damn. Yeah. <laughs> Look Perfect at this. Another. Holy shit. Wow. Uh, there is no signs of movement or activity whatsoever. You watch. You kind of pace around. You get a good look at the uh, the property. So there's a barn. There's a house. It looks like there was once a little uh, fenced-in area for animals. A pen, if you will. Um, but there's no animals. Like I said, the barn is wide open. The do door is just kind of like slamming up against the side as the wind blows it. I'll signal for everybody else to move up or, or go back and get them or whatever. There's a abandoned farm up ahead. No one... There's no sign of life. All right. I mean, we can right. try the same strategy. I can just walk up with the porno in case anything yeah, happens. Let's, I mean, let's that seemed to work really strategy. well the first time. You know, everybody came out safe. Who who's the highest rank in this or this uh, unit? That's him. I am. <laughs> He's talking. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> this is this is this is insane. Yeah. <laughs> we could right, Mark, a grenade from this and then just yeah, go through no. rubble. I assume that you have the NATO helmet on, but no one else does. Like the bright blue, like yeah, you still yeah. have it on. Yeah, <laughs> but no one else does. Yeah. No, no. Mark can say, well, "Let me, let me, uh, maybe someone come with me if they want." But let me go check this out quick. It, it, if you're it, if you're I sneaking, it all over, it's clear. Yeah, so I got a good re. I mean, hmm. decent recon. A B and a C. I mean, you don't trust him. He said it's clear. I mean, he was sitting there with binoculars. You yeah, know. but we'll go. We'll go clear the house, and we'll clear yeah. the. Oh, barn. you're saying you don't want me to go shoot a gun in there? We'll be right back, LT. <laughs> All right, no problem. I like that you called him LT. Ah, brutal. <laughs> you see that? Savage. That's so good. That's his nickname. How is that that bad? Yeah. All right. So I'm gonna um, shoulder my rifle and take out my pistol. Sure. Go. So you're gonna ride to in on your horse? You going in on? No, 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 no. Would pack you, and you... pack and horse are behind. Would yeah, you like to with this shotgun? Okay. Uh, uh, and pickles. I'm both not trained on shotgun. Whoever okay. wants to, yeah. Whoever can sneak. I mean, yeah. I'm. I'm pretty I mean, I might. Sneaking. Yeah. I mean, I'm hoping I am. I got to be in a seat. Stay back with well, Casper, being like, like being a. So the wonder why they be, didn't invite me. It'll, it's a group roll. If you're all gonna like whoever's all going up. So whoever's got right. the low score okay. will do the roll. Okay. Which Who's, is Melisna because we. Safe for all of us to go. I mean, I got three successes. Did, is that is that counting <laughs> it should be inside? Safe. Is that counting? Like, did he go inside? In the no, I didn't go in. He didn't go inside. Right. What does binoculars? That's what we're doing. He, he went around yeah. the whole we're, perimeter, and he was like, look, you could see yeah. through the windows, you could yeah. see into the barn, uh, and just, he saw no, no yeah. signs of activity yeah. whatsoever. We're just gonna clear it for people. We're not gonna dig mm -hmm. through shit. We'll clear it for people, and then we'll call everyone up. Mm -hmm. And any signs of like, you know, lingering booby traps, booby or, traps, and things. Yeah, trip uh, wires. Yeah, I have an A and C, so I think you roll it with your with your B and C. Booby Traps was okay. one of the DVDs we got. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> Booby Traps 7. <laughs> you always got to add the huge it's like really... number. Yeah, <laughs> 22. Nice. And, and all you got to think to yourself is they made 22 of these. Uh-oh. Oh, no. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Push that. Three and a four. Well, you want to push? push? You don't have any ones. So you have to re-roll both of them. Push, little one. Just... Yeah, but I take damage off that, right? Only if You're you such roll a tough a guy, one. though. Uh, oh, okay. So, yeah. yeah, we'll push. So, just re-roll it? Stress. It yeah. Stress, too. Yeah, it's Man, stress. look at those guys. They're not stealthy at all. We'll climb up to that house. <laughs> re-roll it. So, you can't roll any ones. You didn't get any ones. Uh, what all right. You got here? There, there we go. go. You got one. Six and four. You're so, good. what? Do I take a... So, if push uh, was re-rolled... So, I think I, I bet I take a stress for that. Yeah, if push rolled, it's failed, intelligence. you suffer one damage. I think you do take a stress. Intelligence, you push, yep. you take stress. A stress. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. If you push, so if you push a skill roll using right. enter imp, you still fail right. the roll. So you suffer. Take one stress. Okay. What right. if he still fails the roll though? What if he succeeds? If you push you a skill roll using int and still fail, so no, you're fine. You pass. Yeah. So then nothing happens. Oh, okay. You're good. You're you clear. All right. So, okay. what, so how'd you fail and like what'd you do? How did, no, how did we don't he, like that. That's recoup? not how people play here. All right. <laughs> how did he? How did he fail? And no one's he... interested in that. Okay. He doesn't know how he failed. He just kept moving forward. Stepped in a cow patty. Yeah. yeah. Oh, that's hilarious. I love that. <laughs> <laughs>
I need some new boots. Tampa tries to take too seriously. Yeah, yeah. We have like 20 pairs. Of them. <laughs> They're all hanging off the right. front telephone wires. A, right, so, a giant necklace of them. Yeah. So we're just right. We're gonna go through. I mean, I'm. I have a pistol. I don't know what. All right, going. you're going in. Are you going to the house? Clear, you want to go to the barn? Yeah, clearing the house. Going? Clearing the house first. Yeah, all right. You just can't room go by the room. Door to the house. The, the door's down. closed. Matt, always the keep out. bumping. The windows, yeah. uh, the shutters are all open. The blinds are open. You look through the like the one window as you're walking, coming around. It looks like there's a kitchen. Uh, pantries and cupboards are open. Um, okay. There's a there's a kitchen table in the middle of the room. You don't see anything. You get to the door. You kick it open. You clear the kitchen. You go to the next area, and it's uh, like a living room sort of area. There's a TV in there, a sofa, a really gaudy uh, floral sofa in there. There's pictures all over the walls. Of uh, does past it, family members. Does it look like it's been looted, or does it look like there's just no people? There's no people so far. Okay, but it doesn't look looted. It does not look looted. It looks untouched. Okay. okay. What kind of floor is this? So like, far. It's a wooden wood. floor. Okay. Just keeping uh, an eye out for anything that might suggest there's a cellar or something underneath. You make right. your way to uh, down the hall to the next room, and there's a, a bedroom there. And as you open the bedroom door, you see there's what's left of a man lying on the floor with a shotgun in his hand has his head blown completely off and his family or what's left of his family also lying there uh, appear to be victims of shotgun blast everybody who's in there take one stress I was about to say they better take some sort of mental uh, I'm a soldier <laughs> I'm a soldier so what the hell talk over here uh, <laughs> alright one stress uh, <laughs> So these uh, appear to be the the folks who are living here, um, and you've uncovered their fate. So Jeff, you still have to roll your your you guys still have to roll your cool under fire, and then you add your unit morale score. Each first. hit eliminates stress. Yeah. Right now. Yeah. Right now. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Okay. Oh, oh, do you have a good unit morale because of somebody? Uh, <laughs> uh. Oh, that's weird. Unit morale is what a B. No, it's based off command, right? Or what yeah, it? it's based off whatever, right? Whatever so you're bringing. Lowest command. command. Low, yeah. Oh, the lowest command. Or maybe it's highest. No, command. It's, it's, it's highest. It's highest. Okay, command. then it's a B. Yeah. Yeah, you guys have a B. Is it's a, a real yeah, but we B. Have to, we have to see you in order for that, to, right? I think we have to see each other. As, all, 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 as long as we have one other person, I think we get line of sight to a friendly fighter. Right. You get to Which use your you unit morale. Basically, it's your buddy system. Like you're yeah, like, hey, right. dude, you're good. You're good. So I'm rolling two dice. Cool under fire. And... So you roll yours and then a B for me. Okay, mine's a B. You have a B also. Yeah, that's why you I failed. picked this guy. Um, pickles failed. Yeah. Um, so I, I Tonka, pass. you're good. Yeah. So basically, I think I'm just because like nothing crazy is happening. Like, yeah, it's not, not like alien, and I'm running away, but I'm probably just like frozen staring at oh, this shit. guy and the family, yeah. and just like I'm, you know, I'm a soldier. Sure, I was, but I was. I was a specialist, you know. I, I I did engineering stuff, and the you know I wasn't really on the front line, so I probably didn't see this as much. So I'm just yeah, I'll, I'll probably just be kind of like moving a little slow and yeah, pickles his leg behind. You're bit. you're you're continuing on. You're moving. You're going and you're going there and grabbing the shotgun. We'll cover them. And pickles is just yeah. standing there and not All moving. Right. If you then want, we'll you can add up. an 800 870 uh, p uh, shotgun to your equipment. If somebody wants to grab. I'll that. hand that to pickles. Yeah. Uh, okay. Alone. Covered in blood and viscera. But strangely oh, enough, along with six shells. a new weapon probably shocks me out of it. I'm like, oh, no, no toy. <laughs> oh, no, <it> <laughs> yeah. So you get six, uh, six, six 12 gauge uh, shells along nice. with that. That's what the okay. 870p is. That's what I'm talking yeah. about. Rolling okay. the shot. Right. Yeah, and once we, once we think it's clear, we'll, we'll motion yeah. for everyone. Right. We're not trying to world. solo this. Hey, guys, yeah. it's all clear. <laughs> <laughs> we gotta check the barn, but yeah. Right. Once the house is clear, we'll let them know. Oh, sure, what'd yeah. you guys find? I guess we'll say when they were checking inside, I would have been checking the barn. Sure, you can go over the cool. barn while they're in there. You go into the barn, uh, the doors are wide open, you start poking around and the stench is unbearable. Uh, you put some cloth over your face or whatever, you hold your arm up, you start poking around and it looks like um, they had a couple of horses and they just died of uh, malnourishment. They're just all shriveled up. Their skin is around their bones, around their rib cage, uh, and they passed away in a very unfortunate manner as well. In here, check if there's any extra uh, blank saddle blankets or things like that for our own horses that we need. Extra yeah, there's there's two practice. saddles and um, and Viper Cold AF. 
I know, right? Six, six, uh, six saddle blankets. Viper that grenade. was that was like the that was like the equivalent of I search for treasure. I know, <laughs> it totally was. Completely was like dead bodies. Mm. Can I loot it? <laughs> it's a cold. Casper's a cold dude. All right. Uh, you guys want to ransack the house? You can. It's a recon, yeah. We'll call everyone in and then plus right, two, and you guys can, can start uh, start making your way through the house. And okay. Oh, I'll just uh, stay outside. It smells pretty bad in there. I'm sure you guys. You know, I'm not sure what's in there, but uh, pickles looks a little disturbed. So I'll just stay out here. Pickles looks a little disturbed. Always leading from the front. That's what I like about LT. That's right. You know, That's sometimes right. you just gotta right. let the uh, let right. your pawns do the work for you. You know. That's right. Follow your me. Pawns. <laughs> Oh wow! I got two successes. Two successes. Look at you. Anybody wants to search the cabin, they can. That's fine. Hey, look for a DVD player or something. You know. <laughs> hey. uh, movies aren't gonna watch themselves. Your hands shaking. You're we're waddling. You can. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, Viper. Viper comes in. Is there in, power here? Kicks- power or no? there is no power here okay viper's got two successes as well uh you do find another m700 hunting rifle hanging above um the the entryway from the living room to the kitchen uh while you're also poking around you start emptying out the the cupboards in the in the kitchen you find 12 more shotgun shells and you nice. find uh 12 uh rounds for that hunting rifle. What is it, 30 millimeter? 30 out of 6. Yep, you find 12 more of those. Alright, cool. Um, for food rations, you find like three cans or preserves, it's like jarred uh, things that they've pickled uh, beets and things like that. For pickles. No, I'm sorry, what did you say? Pickled what? Pick- <laughs> Doesn't matter what it is if it's pickled. I did, did somebody say pickled? Uh-oh. Yeah, you find three jars of pickled beets and you find three water rations that you're able to scrounge together while you're in there. It's pickled pierogies. Mm. Ken just messed everything up. I know, I just didn't... I clicked the wrong thing. Sorry, I just, I'm now Oak. I'd eat that. You're now playing Casper, and I am... Who am I playing here? <laughs> I'm the sniper now. You find one pack I'm of cigarettes. I'm very sorry. <laughs> package of cigarettes, a Bible... And uh, a remote control for the TV. We're building is, our, um, our, our porn electro- empire. <laughs> one electronic for um, for pickle juice there, if you want to break it down. Okay, I actually do got to roll scavenging tech rolls to break stuff down. Okay. So, I'll just but do that. You do have a remote control, and if it break, you break it down, it is broken down to one electronic. Okay. So a remote control, yes. Yeah, is that just... how the game... Is that how the game does it? It's like components, basically? Like yeah, it's material. like weapon parts, electronics, uh, vehicle That's parts, cool. stuff like that. Yeah. And you can use it to eventually create brand new stuff and like to repair. And that's so awesome. Yeah, 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 that's a great mechanic. Jeez. That didn't work. What is that? Is that another... Just that I'm a search roll? I'm just... No, this is my tech stuff. Oh. Breakdown, yeah. I'm, uh... Yeah, I'm not doing too... Yeah, there we go. All right, um, and you find a a top hat and a Walkman Ooh. with a headset, but no cassette. We're so close, boys. Cassettes, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's just the whole fucking goal. Just find that DVD player, you know, and then we're good to go. Fuck get the get war. Out of the prison. Yeah. Well, no, we need to get in there for some alcohol. Yeah, we need alcohol, DVD player, and our board, and then we'll be good to go. I will. Uh, I will Emerging wear the play. top hat. <laughs> You're gonna wear the top hat. You're gonna take your bright blue NATO hat off and put the top. LT's hat on? literally gone crazy. He's gone <laughs> full yeah. bamboo. Top He's like, gonna, yeah. I'm gonna what? put the. Are I'm gonna you... put the top hat on and then put the NATO helmet on the top uh, of the top hat. What? Oh, you, <laughs> you stressing out, on LT? Oh no, I'm doing great actually. I'm just you know trying to live a little. Hey. It's been yeah, a little boring. You haven't opened up that morphine though, have you? 
No, no, don't worry All about right. it. All right, all right. You look dignified. Hat, NATO on it. He just pulls the NATO band off and puts it on the top hat. <laughs> <laughs> you know, it still says the same thing, right? Yeah. This is this is the slow decline into being a, a marauding band. You know that, right? <laughs> yeah, you're the gonna slow have decay marauders. of the unit. <laughs> yeah. With a porn up, DVD porn <laughs> It started with the porn. <laughs> just, this Ever is like how then. a movie would be, where it's the slow decline of our unit into becoming evil, yeah. you know? Yes. Um, be evil with, LT. with that, we're going to leave off there on our way to the prison uh, for this week. So we'll come back next week. This will probably be one more session of this, and that will conclude our, our playthrough of the Twilight 2000 Alpha rules. Uh, so before we go, we'll do a round table, give everybody a chance to plug where you can find them, what they've got going on. Evan? Uh, I have nothing to plug. Oh. <laughs> Damn. All right, Jeff the end. Baker. Jeff B. Oh, yeah, twitch.tv slash the lollygaggers. We play a variety of tabletop role-playing games. We play Alien and on Mondays and Mute Near Zeros and Mute Near Zero on Saturdays. And we also play on the Freely Publishing channel every other Monday where we play Basin. Yeah. All right. That's right. Yeah, those episodes are sick. The ones with Jeremy. Yeah, it's a good, it's yeah. a good, uh, good game. Yeah, I want to kill his character one of these days. He just keeps closing his eyes and shooting and killing it. I know. I know. Thank you. Uh, Oak, what do you got going on? Uh, you can catch me playing some 5e on the weekends on my channel, Uriance, U-R-A-E-N-C-E. It's on Twitch, YouTube, BitChute. And uh, whenever Matt's running something has room, I'm hanging out with them. Once in a while, uh, say Bert's running some first edition, but I don't think yeah, we're streaming sweet. that one. Cool. Can you got anything going on you want to plug? Yes. <laughs> uh, you can find me on Instagram at uh, old man yells at cloud, period, between all of them. Um, I've got work coming out in a couple of RPGs you'll see in the next year. And also, I do the Plutecast with Matt, which is a comic book podcast where we just uh, talk shit. So you want to check that out i'll put the link in the twitch in the description below uh and jeff h yeah nothing to plug just enjoying playing games with these guys cool all right thank you everybody for joining us as we uh did our first foray into the uh alpha rules for twilight 2000 and we'll be back next week yeah. tuesday at the same time have a good night all right